All right, sorry, I was blowing my nose. Apologies for the heater in the, on the background. It's really cold in the spider basement today. As my man Tupac said, <clears throat> things will never be the same. I'm gonna put a blanket on too, actually. Uh, really behind on DMs. Um, I haven't answered a DM in like a week or so. I'm also behind on my email, so sorry if you emailed me. I meant to get through it today, but <clears throat> instead I finally started some, some uh, Ragnarok stream rendering. I had a hell of a time getting the, uh, the chat for those ones. For some reason, Twitch kept crashing whenever I was recording it. And one of my recordings just got deleted, so I had to do them again. So, sorry about that. But they're up. The first, uh, first two streams with chat are now uploaded onto YouTube. I just have to finalize it once it goes through copyright checks and everything. You use email? Yeah, for, um, uh, mo I mostly use my email for, uh, for getting notifications about, like, uh, transfers and stuff, like, like, AdSense payments, stuff like that. Although, it's not really that important. I also use email to con to contact some contractors for the game. My nose is still running a little bit. It's really painful to transfer VODs from Twitch to YouTube. Um, to, it's, it's not too bad. It just takes some time and also rendering it together with chat and cutting out the breaks and everything. Um, it's kind of a pain in the ass, yeah. get your coffee and get ready for chaos. I'm drinking tea, actually. Are you familiar with Disco Elysium? Not only am I familiar with it, uh, I streamed it. It's pretty good. Is the Ragnarok video happening? Ask me again in a couple days, and I should have an answer for you. Hopefully. Maybe not, but we'll see. So Merry Christmas everyone, hope you had a good Christmas. I had a horrible day, spent it angry at my kids pretty much the whole day because um, they were dressed up as elves and you know how I feel about those. So, you know, just the whole day, just, just absolutely furious. They had, um, they had a really good day. Still a couple of presents left to open for them. Like, like I don't mean from the wrapping, like there's still a couple things still in the boxes. Did you see Geralt is racist against elves in the Witcher show? The new one, the, the blood origin, I haven't watched that yet. I hear it's really bad. Man, like, I guess I just hate circle jerks. Like I, I just I hate how much people are hating on the Witcher show because it's not faithful to the books. And I just know that most of the people that are hating on it haven't read the books. I just know that they haven't. So they're just taking part of the circle jerk and that it just makes me so mad. I just know that they haven't. Yes, Joe, I agree. Move on. <laughs> I did. I could say it shit. There you go. You are one of the few, the proud. You can judge the uh, the faithfulness of the adaptation. But remember, a faithful adaptation is not the only way to judge an adaptation. You can judge it in different ways, too. The show is pretty sympathetic in its portrayal of elves. What do you think of that? Well, I think it's just the way that they're not really being very faithful in the adaptation. <laughs> Um, spoilers for the Witcher universe. I don't know exactly uh, uh, where um, 
the the spoiler would come from. Uh, maybe it's just like it's it's more something that you just kind of like realize as you read the books and uh, no read the books and so to some extent playing the games. Um, humans are like invaders in that world and are encroaching on the territory uh, owned by the elves who are supposedly the natives of that planet. Um, the elves are not native there either. They are also invaders. The elves are not from that planet. <laughs> so the humans are just doing to the elves what the elves did to someone else before that. Like the, the elves ain't from there either. <laughs> and, and the humans don't want to be there. Like... The elves did something bad, and then the humans just like uh, like I don't know how many humans it have to be like a like a tens of thousands, maybe even a few million humans, basically just got like sucked into the, uh, through like portals, and some of them get got deposited onto this planet where the Witcher books take place on, and uh, they're just trying to make the best of it, man. Like they got a, a cicade. I, a cicade? I don't know what the fuck that is. Yeah, but so did like a bunch of different monsters and everything too. So, um, it is it is hilariously like misguided um, to say that uh, that the humans are just being like awful invaders that are that are against the the native elves. Uh, not to say that the humans' actions are completely like great. Absolutely fucking not. But like, damn, like. Uh, some people don't get that about the elves in the in the Witcher in the Witcher books. I don't really remember the Vrans being mentioned in the books. Are they mentioned in the books? I remember like in Witcher Two, both times I played it. Um, I play more than that. When I played it before the books, and then after I, I, I read the books, I played Witcher two again, and both times I was like, "Vrans, who the fuck are those?" The what? The Vrans are a race of lizard people, or maybe they have, they're amphibians, or maybe they're they're a mix of both somehow. Um, and they were apparently there before the elves were there. Maybe they're the true native race to that planet. Um, you can the the city at the end of Witcher two, Loch Muin. Uh, was originally a, a Vran city, and the elves uh, killed all of them, and they they blame it on climate change, but they didn't. They they killed them all. Plot twist: the Vrans took over the place and so on. Yeah, the, yeah, it could be just genocide all the way down. That's true. Yeah. Isekide. Isekai? Isekade? Mario? It's a subgenre of that. Oh, I know what it is. Unfortunately, I, I know, I know what it is. Yep. I know, I know what it is. Thank you, everybody. I know what it is. Have you seen the new Jordan Peele movie, Get Elf? I have not, no. Uh, I think someone just asked, do I not, do I just not like the elves in the Witcher universe? Am I okay with other elves and other media? Um, I mean, before reading the Witcher books, I was pretty neutral on elves, maybe neutral to negative. Like, I've always found elves in uh, Lord of the Rings to be kind of, kind of snooty and kind of like, eh, you know? Um, so I'm, I talk about this, uh, at great length in the Witcher 3 video, actually. And by great, great length, I mean, like, I don't know, for a couple minutes. Um, most races in fiction are, uh, human butts. Um, that's exactly how I say it, too. Human butts is a joke. Um, so human, human butts. So they're humans, but they, they have this exaggerated trait of humans. Um, it is exceedingly rare that you will that you will find any any um uh race in any fiction that isn't that uh and you could probably make a strong argument that it's just outright impossible in the same way that you can't really imagine a new primary color 
uh, that you that you can you can't really imagine any race of people that isn't got some sort of human in them because you are a human and any human that that imagines something is going to have carries with them the limits of human imagination you know what i mean um so in most media uh well i shouldn't say most because it's probably been a lot a lot since then but from lord of the rings and the and the the writers that usually kind of like uh copy lord of the rings um elves are humans but better that's what they are that's that's the but humans but better like like klingons in, in star trek are humans but very warlike uh very aggressive it's, it's it's that part of human spawn into a whole entire race uh it's kind of fucked up actually um elves are usually humans but better that doesn't mean they're perfect but they're but they're better um you know they're they're a lot more uh in tune with their environment they usually care a lot more about that they, they're not really all that warlike they're more defensive they can still be very you know um martial in in how they they, they do things but they're usually a lot more wise you know what i mean um witcher elves are humans but worse like uh, there's an interview with Sokovsky who, where he he just he just lays the cards out on the table and he's like, look, um, most of the stuff that he did in the Witcher books were just were just the the art of retelling, where he just took a lot of things that were that were done already and he just retold it in his own way, usually with a subversion. So you have a lot of fairy tales that are subverted, um, you have a lot of uh, races that are subverted that are come from different different parts of uh, different books. Uh, there's a part in um, oh god, is it the third book? the third well it's not the third book it's like the persona series there's like uh it starts at persona 3 uh so there's the two short story books and then there's the five part saga and i think it's the second book in the five part saga or the third part of the five of the five part saga um where there is there is a scene that just is like the forming of the fellowship from the fellowship of the ring but instead of this being this it this really like um Oh my God! Like this is such a, a a pompous ceremony and my and my axe or whatever. It's just the Geralt sitting around a campfire with a bunch of people while they're eating fish, I think, and them all going like, "Well, we're not going to let you go on your on, on your own, and you're not leaving without us." And Geralt's like, "Fuck you, I will." And they're like, "Yeah, right, you won't." And they don't give a shit, you know. So it's it's that sort of subversion of lost storytelling. Um, so he so I think Sarkozy did this on purpose with the, with the elves coming from from Lord of the Rings elves um, to making them instead of them being humans but better, they are humans. But worse so they are like some of our worst traits like taken to their exaggeration and uh and i think one of the messages of of the the books is to see how much worse we can be and that we are very much capable of going down that path and that we shouldn't and it's kind of like holding a mirror up to you and being like you know this is how much worse it can get instead of the, the elves being like look how much better it can get and you know hopefully you don't do either you know stay stay in a stay in your human lane you know uh like the elves have caused s countless genocide countless genocides like just it's just insane the damage the elves have done in in uh the witcher universe oh well at least that's my interpretation of it because um there's a lot of things that happen in the witcher books that uh are just left up to your interpretation and there's propaganda there's biases a lot of it is is uh you know seeped in that unreliable space so it is uh it's it's difficult to to judge that properly I agree with all your points, but I still like the Scoia'tael because I love plucky terrors. Yeah, so the Scoia'tael are still very much sympathetic, and what the humans are doing to the elves is, is not nice. It's not it's not right at all. Um, both sides are, are really, really bad there. And if I had to pick between the Scoia'tael and the humans, I would think that the humans are doing worse than the Scoia'tael. Um, but if, if the roles were reversed, the Scoia'tael would probably be treating the, the human version of Scoia'tael much worse than than, uh, than the humans are to Scoia'tael currently. I said that kind of as a mouthful. Sorry. Who's your favorite book character? Uh, probably Siri. I like the Siri parts. Do you think most fantasy race issues are just a simplified and cringy parroting of real life racism? I think they can be for sure, um, but I don't know enough about that to comment on it. Uh, I think it, I think it could be, but I don't really know how. I think it's I think it's incredibly difficult to to write any fantasy race without brushing against the idea of racial traits and once you get into the idea of racial traits and you also get into the idea of like well what kind of what kind of race does that match up with like real real life equivalents um 
what kind of trait is being spun out here that's that's a human trait that is being personified as well with it like or exaggerated with it um i, I think it can be difficult but at, at that point you're arguing basically that it shouldn't there shouldn't even be any uh any fantasy races which eh, i don't know So if this is annoying, which question for you is part of the Witcher 3 delay, how much time you would like to dedicate post-launch to assessing its response? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, one one of the biggest Witcher 3 delay reasons were, was that it was originally one big video, and after the Witcher 1 video came out, I was like, okay, well, I don't have the limit that I had before, where it was like one big thing that had to stay under 12 hours, and then... Like then I and I also saw the response to the Witcher One video had and the response to the Witcher Two video had and it's like okay people really prefer the Witcher One video to the Witcher Two video, um, and the Witcher Three video was a bit different than it is now to say the least. Like the the Witcher the Witcher Three video was once only around four hours long and now it's like closer to twelve. So yeah, there's lots of factors that go into it. Anyway, that's enough Witcher talk for now. enough witcher talk have you read calvin and hobbes in preparation for this game i've read a little bit of calvin and hobbes in in, in my time on this earth but not recently no all right so this is captain spirit uh we have gotten through what is undoubtedly going to be the worst uh life is strange game life is strange before the storm the game so bad it made chat mad. Uh, I don't think we're ever going to play another game like that that is worse than that on the stream. Like, honestly, bottom three ever that we've ever done. I'm surprised we got through it. Thank you for, for sticking it out with me. Um, I've done a little bit of reading on it since, since the stream, and I am just absolutely dumbfounded at how many people think it's okay. Like, I was typing into Google, like... Life is Strange Before the Storm, awful, terrible, and then I, I, I scraped the bottom of the barrel. I even started putting Reddit into the Google search too. Awful Reddit, and I would just see Reddit posts, and it'd be like people like being like, oh, I really like the game, and I like the game part of it, but I wish the ending was a bit better, or, you know, like uh, the characterization of Rachel kind of felt, I was like, what the hell, this, this, this just, it's just completely, it's just trash. What, what the hell are you guys talking about? You know, like... Um, and this is coming from someone who, look, look, I know I'm a video game critic, but like, a as you can see, there's a difference between Critic Joe, Real Joe, and Streamer Joe, alright? Real Joe and, and Streamer Joe are, are very much more in line than, than Critic Joe. Critic Joe is like, I have opinions on this, and I think things could be done better, and I'm gonna justify them, and because I justify my opinions and, and my, my criticisms, it makes me come across as way more fucking negative as, as I possibly can, and also I can't resist, you know, being a little, a little funny and kind of, uh, kind of, uh, embracing hyperbole a bit in the scripts whereas if you watch the streams you'll you know quickly notice that i am actually pretty easy to please it's really rare that i will that i will play something and say this is irredeemable trash um it's pretty rare that i'll watch something or even read something and think that too like even though i can be really critical and harsh on things usually i can see the good in it and have a decent enough time like there's only been a handful of things where i couldn't do that and before the storm is one of them and i i, I just i just can't believe <laughs> that there so many people that are like this was fine or i love this it was so fucking bad man oh man it was so bad oh shit it was bad anyway so there's no way this is going to be worse right <sighs> all right captain spirit so this is the prologue demo thing to life is strange 2 apparently we're supposed to play this first i'm really surprised there's snow for some reason i didn't realize it was a cold game so we're going to play this, and then we're going to jump right into Life is Strange 2, um, and we'll see. Here we go. What other games are irredeemable trash for you? Uh, Hello Neighbor, and I don't want to say Steins Gate because we didn't finish it, but that's it pretty much. Hello Neighbor and, and Before the Storm, those are the only two that, that we streamed at least. Uh, playing on my own, uh, launched No Man's Sky, I guess? But even that had the cool kind of planet to space transition would you like to enable subtitles uh yes i would like to enable subtitles hella hella subtitles english subtitle size Aww.
All right, how's the sound of the music? Spirit of my silence, I can hear you. Hello, darkness, my friend. And I don't know. All right, well, now we're getting copyright claims. There's a forest and a an maker before us, but I don't know where to begin. But I don't know where well, this is cozy. to begin again. I Sounds so okay with the lyrics. If this is if I'm like audible right now and the music is still good, then that's a good sign for the rest of the of the with game. The Sounds fine, a bit loud. It's good. Most people are saying it's fine. What is this planet? I don't know. We've never been here before. Maybe we're on the edge of the universe. Hey, cool. Let's see if we can find some aliens. Hey, the ground is moving. The planet's gonna eat us. We have to get back to the ship right now. Then let's get the heck out of here. Oh no, the control panel's not working. We're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Oh no. Hold on. Let me just give you a hand. Is this other hand grabbing it? Yay! Yep. Okay. Yay! You ha! Woo! We're saved! It's a miracle! No, it's just me, Captain Spirit, who can bend all matter to his will. Okay, Homelander. I still got the power. Now I just need to make a cool costume for Captain Spirit. That's the name of the game. I gotta have a cool cape to fly. Wow, 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 wow. Good thing I have one. Mask or no mask? Secret identity or not? Hmm. Helmet. Yep, looks cool so far. Let's see. What about the armor? Light armor, heavy armor. Oh, light armor. We want to be able to move. There's no way this room so would be this clean. Cool. Should he be dark or colorful? Colorful. Trogdor. Beware, Mantroid. Mantroid. Watch out. Captain Spirit is ready for battle. He's pretty good. Captain Spirit. Title drop. Here we go. The awesome adventures of Captain Spirit, who is either going to die or witness a murder at the end of this. Hello, Saturday morning. Yep, here we I go. I can do anything I want today. Okay, can we rewind? Look at your hand. No? Okay. Hmm. Um, this seems... I could do a training session with my power. Okay, am I f forgetting what it was like? But this seems like a huge step up from Life is Strange 1 and uh, Before the Storm in terms of, like, visuals. Like, this feels pretty fucking good. Like, damn. Wow. 
Watch out, supervillains. Today I make my own superhero costume. Okay, Max. Man, I wanted to go to that. But Dad had to watch the playoffs. Yep, he had to. Nothing we could do. Had to watch the playoffs. Every superhero team needs a supervillain team. Well, that's pretty good. So glad I did my English homework already. Miss Stroud's pretty nice, and she likes my stories. She doesn't. She's lying. The secret treasure is buried out there in the wild. Now, I have to locate the second part of the map. Hell Volcano. Forest of Trolls. Oh no. Alien Fields. Six evil dog of Satan. All right. Sorry, you're too cute to fight evil. Whoa, what do you mean? He's a power bear. I hope I can draw as good as mom someday. Chris, since you're going to be my own superhero, this book is a great start. You can be everything I am not. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life watching you save the world. <sighs> Oh, rip mom, love forever, super mom. Oh, 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 no. It is time for my <laughs> secret tattoo. Only my team will know what it means. All right. Captain Spear doesn't need weapons. Okay, Dr. Who. just in case. Oh, there you go. All right. Power Bear and... Noctarius? Are you ready for the ultimate battle of good versus evil? Yeah, let's go. You can't win this battle, Noctarius! It's already over, Power Bear! Yeah! Fool. Don't let Mantroy control you! Nobody controls me! Mantroy is my leader! And he wants you to die. <laughs> Give up now. I mean, it's just a bear. Fight. You're not the boss of me, power bear. Why, why Mantroid? Why Mantroid? Mantroid is your boss now. Why did you join his team? The same reason you joined Captain Spirit's team. To win. Yeah. Captain Spirit has helped the world over and over. Liar! Where were you and Captain Spirit when Mantroid saved my life? Huh? Good guy? I'm sorry. Shut up! Shut up! How many times <laughs> do I have to stop you? <laughs> Until you do stop me! Yeah, that's true, yeah! Oh, man. Captain Spirit, Captain Spirit, please come to my aid. Where's the I morphine can't gun? I defeat Noctarius on my own. I can't. Captain Spirit. What do you mean? You've won. Release him. Destroy him. I don't... How do I... How do I do destroy him? Oh. It's a... Destroy him. Hello, Power Bear. I'm here to finally destroy Noctarius. You never fail us, Captain Spirit. No, Captain you Spirit can't British? To me. I'm just a puppet. Oh no. Then let's cut your strings. No, don't. I give up. I Mantroid, help me master. You can't kill me. You said you don't kill people. Ah. Good oh, job, no. but we still have to deal with Mantroid. With Noctarius is he's charge, fucking dead. Our team is going to win every battle. He's fucking dead. Do 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 walkie talkie. No, I, I'm I'm looking at R B Charles. Be right there. Be right there. This is a lie. Hmm. This is a perfect day to watch Frozen. 
Last time, Dad told me not to sing along so loud. Bugs Motel. Hey, Spider Baby. I think you caught your lunch in your web. And there's a snail moving so fast. He's in one place. <laughs> okay. I miss playing ball with my friends before we moved. Do you want to build a snowman? I've only seen the first 30 I've minutes read of this Frozen. One so many times. I miss how. Chris. He feels like he's so far away, even though he lives on the other side of town. Thanks for letting me read this. Now it's my turn to give you a book to read. Your pal Hal. Oh, oof, Hal's dead. Oh, repel. Oh, repel. Gotta have a super cape. Only Captain Spirit can wear it. Chris, I need mean now. I could take over the town with this army. Or the world. Advent calendar. Oh man, it's Christmas! Jeez, oh. good job, chocolate hog. Okay, I think I think we should go. This isn't greedy, right, Santa? Plus, Dad will love that I want basketball lessons. Dear Santa Claus, I think I've been good. Here is my list for Christmas. Smiley heart, smiley heart. Hot dog adventures. Play box console. Drawing paper and pens. Basketball lessons. Sincerely, Chris. Dad said he was going to fix that last month. Right. What the hell, Dad? Only my brain waves can activate the monitor. Alright, let's go get food. Maybe we can come back and look at things later. Thought breakfast was ready. Doesn't seem very ready to me. Next time I tell you to come, don't ignore me. But I... Don't. This isn't a hotel, buddy. I get things to do. Pour yourself some milk. I didn't say drink it. This art style reminds me of something, and I can't place it. Breakfast of champions. It's grounded? So how are the playoffs? <sighs> What'd you expect, a waffle? I'm good. I like moms. It's, it's, go it's good. It's, it's good. good. Oh, you can lie better than that. Dad, I'm not lying. It's just the uh, eggs are good. Listen, buddy, you won't hurt my feelings if you don't love my eggs. I know this doesn't compare to your mother's breakfast. What is your hair doing? You know what? I'm going to watch some cooking shows and learn how to be a super breakfast chef. And you could be my official food taster. Deal? Yeah. Okay. You just... Pounding back a brewski at breakfast? What are you what are you doing? You're yeah, you're drinking. You're drinking? You're drinking beer? Yeah. Before you eat? Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's game day. Oh, oh sorry, I didn't Dads realize. Yeah, okay. Are allowed to drink early. This is true. Yep. Yep, hey, sorry, I didn't realize it was game day. I don't need a lecture from my son. Thanks. Yeah. I, I don't drink that much. Lord of the game that I mean, what am I supposed to do in this fucking town? Go to church like all these assholes? Oh! Sorry. Don't swear, okay? I don't. I swear in front so of my kids all the swear. time. <laughs> Looks like I'm off the team. Nah. You're cool. <laughs> like a rebel. <laughs> hey. 
Hey, is your, uh, your arm okay? Looks better. Anybody uh, ask you about it or uh, say anything? Did you hurt him? It's fine. It kind of it's it's it kind of hurts. Well, it kind of hurts a little. Really? All right. I, I can give you an ice pack and maybe one of my pills. No pain. And no okay. What 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 is this? Is this like chicken with is he a bad dad or not? Like let's let's just. <laughs> So first of all, he's like, oh, like yeah, the you you come when I call you for breakfast, all right? Like, sorry. First of all, he's making breakfast. That's nice. You come when I, when you fucking breakfast, boy. And then he gives the breakfast. It's not very good. It's like, oh shit, there's tension. And then it's like, you can tell me if the cooking's bad. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do better. And it's like, oh okay, he's a good dad. And then he start and he's pounding back the Bruce. He's at breakfast. He's like, oh, he's a bad dad. But then he explained it's game day. So it's like, oh okay, he's a good he's a good dad again. And then he's swearing in front of the kid, which is a good dad move because it's like just being open and honest with your with your kids and now it's like oh no, maybe he he put the, the bruises on the kit like like what is this I'm swelling it makes me sad that i that, that you got hurt uh oh you got it's hurt not that bad i'm fine okay there's no way you would phrase oh uh, unless he think did he get drunk and hurt him maybe if he got drunk and hurt him you could phrase it like that hey okay don't bother you anymore all right you know Rachel so, Amber? So you must be excited for Christmas. So excited. Always. I'm always excited for Christmas. Intent. I was hoping Santa might maybe get me a new console since mine is broken. Then Santa needs to get me a new job. It has to be a console. Basketball costs 10 bucks. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, since it's Saturday, are we gonna get a Christmas tree? No. You said we could get a real pine. Yes, I did, and yes, we are. Okay. But I just want to watch the game before we go, okay? But you always fall asleep. <laughs> I won't today. And if I do, just wake me up and we'll go. Promise. Okay. You promise? Well, I do. What is this game on in the background? Is it paused? Now go take advantage of your weekend. Perfect weather outside for you to play. Whatever. You're free. Come grab me later. Oh. It's definitely game day. Beers are just for the kitchen. Don't drop the glass. Don't drop the glass. Finn, what are you doing? Finn, what do you mean? Why you don't put it on the counter for it, Finn? All right, you okay? You're good. Yeah. Oh, oh god. Oh. All right, we went okay. Okay. What would Captain Spirit do? Captain Spirit would wash the dishes. Oh man, this is cold. I might have to check out the water eater. The water eater? Awesome things to do. I can make Captain Spirit's costume now. Maybe I can find what I need around. Captain Sp Spirit's treasure is buried around here somewhere. I need to assemble the two parts of the map to find the way. Okay, what is all this shit to do? I just want to play Life is Strange too. Right, let's just walk around and see. Alright. Luke. I can pick up all the beer cans so we can recycle. Yeah, let's see. Score, yeah! Are you insane? I was drinking those beers! Pulverize. The beer can monster cannot be. Mm. 
seriously? <sighs> Ooh, Dad's going shopping. Sugar. I don't know what that is. Battery, coffee, beer, milk, barbecue chips. What's under sugar? Pa oh, paper. I was expecting it to be a food. Paper. Okay. Yeah, we're adding ice cream. Ice cream. Let's see. What do we need? Remember that episode of Peppa Pig where they they ha they're sticking to the list when they're shopping, and then when they get to the the, the checkout, someone's put homemade chocolate cake in, into the cart and then they're and they're scanning it through and they're like who the hell put this this homemade chocolate cake which is clearly not homemade chocolate cake because they're buying at the store how, how is that in the cart and it turns out it was daddy pig daddy pig put it in he thought it'd be nice for pudding Boring. it's an amazing plot twist amazing plot twist Speaking of amazing plot twists, yesterday they're they're watching Robocar Poli, alright? I don't know what the hell this is, but it's got the most infectious song ever. With uh, Robocar Poli. They're watching Robocar Poli, okay? And it's it's about it's basically Paw Patrol before Paw Patrol, and they're kinda like it's kinda like in the universe of cars, except they're it's not Disney. And there's humans in it, but it's like talking cars and talking like like bus uh school bus um and they like the robocar police crew can like turn into mechs like the transformers so they can move between like standing with arms and legs robot form and then they can they can they can drive okay so like it started off i've seen this this show a couple times and this was like i don't know i don't know if i think it was like season two so they started to get a little bit dark with it so like like, okay, I want to be really clear. This is, like, on... This is just above, like, Peppa Pig level when it comes to, like, the age that we're trying to hit here, okay? This isn't... This isn't a Pokemon or a Pokemon, all right? Like, this is... This is pretty low. This... I would say it's even, like, like younger kids than, than typically, like, Paw Patrol even, all right? So, like, they're watching Robocar Poli, all right? And there's an episode, and it's, like, they got the kid cars, three three of the kid cars around, which are just, like, smaller versions of the cars. They're They're, like... I don't know how that works. Who's giving birth to these cars? But like they're 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 children cars, so they're like four or five years old. And like the adult cars are like gathered around to tell them about stranger danger. And they're like, don't don't like talk to strangers. No matter what they say, if it's if it's an adult you don't know, you don't talk to strangers, even if they're gonna give you candy or whatever like that. I'm like, alright, where's this going then? So then the the children cars are like on a street later on in the episode, like the next scene. And this, this truck shows up, who I looked up afterwards, his name is literally like Truck X, alright? Truck X shows up, he's got a fucking, he's got a hat on, a, a green baseball cap on, he's got like, like creepy glasses, and a fucking mustache, alright? Like a pencil mustache, alright? This is the characterization of Truck, Truck X or whatever, alright? And he's like, oh, oh, just, you know, toy delivery. I'm a toy delivery truck and I'm delivering some toys to the toy store. And the kids are like, oh, really? And he turns around and opens the back of his, like, his, his fucking, like, um, the, the, you know, the storage part of the truck, opens it up, and there's, like, like a bedroom full of toys in the back of his fucking truck, right? And he's like, look at all my toys. You could play with them. And he, and, he, and the kids are like, yeah, let's go play with them. And then one of the other, the children cars are like, wait, 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 no. Like we're not supposed to talk to strangers, and then the other kids are like, the kid cars are like, no, but it's 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 a toy delivery truck. We're fine with it. It's fine. And then she's like, oh, okay, I guess it's fine. So then they go inside the 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 truck to play with the toys, and he fucking like slams the shutter down and just fucking yeets out of the fucking city with them. Like he kidnaps these three kids, and I'm like, this is Robocar Poli. What the fuck is going on? So they're like bouncing around in the back of the fucking truck, and Truck X is like, wah ha ha, and like. There's a scene where he's like going through a tunnel later and they're trying to catch him and the, the kids are like crying inside and I swear to god he turns back, looks back into the truck and is like, shut up, it was your fault for falling for this or something. Like, it was like, what the hell is this? I was like just in fucking disbelief. <laughs> 
<laughs> and this is like a kid show. They just fucking kidnapped. Them. Anyway, so Robocar, what they they eventually catch him. One of them like gets like grabs him from the back. And they have like I don't know like a tow cable or whatever. And the other two like get in front of him in the tunnel and they slow him down. But it's like I couldn't believe it. I can, dude, Joe, did you make? I didn't know this is a real thing. It's a real thing that happened in Robocar Poli. Anyway, that's what I wanted to say. Seattle, small riots and protests are continued to mount one, one month after the unexplained deaths of a local man and a police officer. An official statement from the police has not been released, but sources say the man appeared to have been shot by the officer while the latter's cause of death remains unknown. The Seattle Police Department have been accused of civil rights by civil rights groups of mishandling the incident, which led, the public pro to lo which led to the public protests and rioting. All right. This can make a pretty good helmet. Yeah, that's true. I looked up truck X. Like, you see him? Like it's just, it's just. <laughs> Damn, you're on fire. Yeah, I'm on fire. Okay, that's a good start. But now it's time to build the rest of my costume. Just a friendly toy delivery truck. Nothing bad going on here. Oh, hmm. don't put your head in the microwave. Maybe I could cook something for Dad. It's it's got aluminum foil all over it. Don't do that. Okay, I don't think we should cook anything for Dad. If he wants to eat, he can make his own food. I've never seen a beaver around here. What the fuck is this? Open your goddamn eyes. Yeah. Goddamn it's early, terror. but I can make Dad some mac and cheese. Yeah, whatever. Let's do it. He's too lazy. And he won't eat anything. Maybe then he'll stay awake. Beginning countdown to launch. Five. Oh, that four, microwave needs to be cleaned. Three, two, one. Is it actually going to take two minutes? Fry. Big. Joe's unhinged, unhinged kids show rant. The the kids show is the unhinged part of that, right? Like it's it's an unhinged show, not the unhinged Joe. J J Joe is not the unhinged part of that. Now you will learn your lesson and stay clean. They're already clean. They're in the dryer. The, the, it goes in the basket once it's dried. It's in a hamper before that. What are you doing? No one puts dirty laundry in a basket like this. All right, we're just gonna wash it. All right. I hope I set this right. Make a podcast, Joe. With who? That Solo podcast? Set Christmas decorations yet. Make something come up. Oh, is mom dead? I don't think so. Dark come door. On. Don't be afraid. Go in there and turn on the heat. But first, put on your magic cape. Oh, uh, okay. We never use this door in winter because of the snow. On fire all night. Time to read some emails. Here's my hot dog man. Hot dog man. Join the revolution. Want to play with hot dog man? Take a picture of your kid covered with mustard and send it. What? Lots of hot dog man exclusive toys to win every month. I can't see dad selling homes. Get real about your future today. Become a realtor. Mess that up. Our 10 week course will give you everything you need to start selling homes and making your dreams come true. Whoa, is he getting us tickets again? Best dad ever. Yeah. That would be a blast being a freight hopper. Choo choo. Recently our Beaver Creek field offices have received multiple complaints about unruly teenage freight hoppers in the area. Chloe, they have a minor reputation around the Northwest, so please do not let them provoke you into a confrontation. Instead, if you encounter any problem or situation involving this group, please report it immediately to your supervisor. If you have any questions, please contact me by email during office hours. Thank you. Mike Stevenson. All right. Oh. Why is that those there? Those are dad's pages. 
Oh, Stat World. Oh, man. He's really into hockey. Holy shit. Letter. Dear Charles, we just wanted to let you know how much we both care about you and Chris. Charles and Chris, really? I know life has been hard since Emily left us. Oh, she's dead for sure. But we're still a family and we intend to keep it that way. That includes making sure Chris is getting all the care he needs at this fragile age, but not that fragile. We've always been honest with you, so please take our concern as a sign of our love, the way you loved our beautiful daughter. We also heard through a friend that you were in some kind of bar fight, but the police declined to arrest you. Thank God. Please take care of yourself. To cut to the chase, we want to help, so so we hope you allow us to take care of Chris for the next year, or as long as you need, and consider joining a support group. Oh. 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 That was way longer than two minutes. Enter pin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, with a zero. Nope. All right. I don't know what it is. It's gonna be really hot. Hey, Dad, I made you some food. Did you make that for me? You wouldn't get up during the game, so I thought you could eat out here. I can nuke this mac and cheese in no time. Not bad. Not bad at all. You better start cooking from now on, buddy. Mom made the best mac and cheese. I mean... She did make the best mac and cheese. But this is the perfect comfort food for a winter game day. Thanks. Well, taste it first. Best mac and cheese ever. Yeah, get fucked, Mom. Already surpassed you. What is this game? Dad. Yes, yes, yes. Come on. Just gonna throw a log in? You think they grow on trees? Come on. Hey, can you get that? Are you are you are you kidding? Goodbye, log. Chris, answer the phone, please. I was putting a log in the fire. Shut up. Where's the phone? I don't know where it is. Oh, there it is. It's on the wall. Wow, this is nineties. Uh. Hello? Good morning, sir. How are you this glorious day? Hang up. Um... Just hang up. Okay? Hey, who is that? Who keeps calling? I don't know. Uh, who is this? Thank you for asking, young man. My name is Derek, and I'm a proud member of the Universal Uprising Church. I'd love to tell you and your family about Jesus, our righteous Lord and Savior. Our church just wants you and your loved ones to share the Holy Spirit. Spirit? Um, oh, my dad loves spirits. We're just watching the game. Well, always remember that our Lord is watching out for you. By the way, is your mother or father available to speak? Well, I have to ask first. Chris, who the hell are you talking to? Nobody, Dad. Jesus is... Chris... These are the most important numbers for you on this list. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh man, I could cool just story, Dad. murder a pizza right now. Exit. Nah, we need to put like our clothes on or whatever. Soft bullet gun. Shoot that. Oh yeah, we're doing that. In the head. In the head. head. Shot. Ow, cheap shot. I'm going down. Oh, he's one of those cool alcoholic dads. You can't kill the zombie jock. No oh, way. Classic dad move. Shot. I am a super zombie. Well, I'm a superhero. Can't argue with that. Zombie down. Captain Spirit strikes back. Sorry, Pop. 
It's war. I wonder why Dad never hangs out with Nick anymore. He died. No, no. I wish I could have gone on a hike with Mom. This has to be Mom's. She liked art. Yeah. Mark Jeffers. <gasps> no. Stole the ball from that piece of shit. Hmm. Let's check this out. Ooh, that looks scary. I should read that. The Nightshade Diaries. A Robocar Police story. <laughs> you suck! <laughs> oh no. I hate going to the water eater's lair. Interview. Welcome to W-H-E-R-O. Today we are honored to What's have that? an interview with the world's most awesome superhero, Captain Spirit. Hello, Beaver Creek. Captain Spirit, when do you think you will defeat Mantroid? Mantroid is a bully and a coward. He can't hide, but he can run. We heard reports that he is putting together a team of supervillains. Do you have any message for them? We'll forgive them. We will forgive them if they don't join Mantroid. He's not worth it. We have to live in peace. What kind of a name oh, is Mantroid? That's my job. And that's why we love you. Can you tell us who your superheroes are? Me. The only hero I have is me. That's good to know. Can you give us a hint about how you discovered your epic powers? Drugs. No. Okay, do you have any final words for your audience? Be nice and always fight for the good team. Thank you, Captain Spirit, for being our hero. And now back to W-H-E-R-O News. World Hero News. All right, so there's too much shit to do here because I don't really have much context for what's going on in the dynamic and also it's not cringy like max's lines um let's just uh try and move on a little bit more i wonder when i can start to shave superhero shave depends wasn't it revealed once that that super, the only way superman can shave is that he has to like get a mirror or something and use his own eye lasers no diving today nemo Makes sense. Would a mirror, like, really reflect Superman's eye lasers? Uh-oh. It's a special mirror. Kryptonite mirror? Seven years. Six years. Okay, so we're, like... We're, we're at least seven years, one month. Man. Leo is already way taller than this. I'm too old to be measured now, right? Locked. I wonder what dad keeps in here. Drugs. If I smoke in the fortress, I'm breaking the superhero code. Superman has heat lesion, not lasers. Okay, DC fan, sorry. They look like lasers to me, all right? Like, from what I remember. Fix. Uh-oh. Yes! Hell yeah. I'm glad Dad kept Mom's perfume. It smells just like her. I hope I get to go practice with Dad again this summer. I had a I had a uh, a psychopath moment the other week, um, at the grocery store. Of course, I was at the grocery store and I was I was standing in line, and uh, there was a, a couple in front of me, um, and the woman was wearing the same perfume that that Lily uses, and like I I I could smell it on her, and it was just pissing me off. <laughs> 
how dare someone else use the same perfume? <laughs> like... <laughs> oh, I could use this to make some cool armor. What? Because I was confused. It was like, what? Like what? What the fuck? I smell Lily, but I know see Lily. This is just fucking, just fucking pissing me. They're naked. Whoa. Whoa. Butts and boobs. Nice. Organs. Best boobs. Yes, this will totally protect me from man Troy. Oh, we have one to put this on, okay. I'm almost done. Steal one. We're not gonna we, we, we steal a cigarette for. We don't smoke. Dad doesn't play mom's records as much as before. Oh no, DMCA. No, 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 don't, don't, don't. Oh god. Maybe I can start her off. I'm a lost I love listening to mom's old records. I love not getting copyright claims. Careful of booby traps. No, those are in the closet. Read. Console. Oh. My. God. Dad actually got me the new play box? No way! Uh, did he though? The looks used. Dad used to always talk about this basketball. Like, this basketball specifically? Wow, Dad had fans when he was playing in high school. Dear Charles Erickson, I am 12 and want to play pro basketball one day. My parents take me to all your games. You are great on the court. The last game was the best I've ever seen. I hope you are drafted for an NBA team. Thank you and see you the next game. Todd Hamill. That's scary. Uh-oh. So we moved because Dad couldn't pay for the house? That sucks. Best clamp properties. Clamp. Clamp sounds suspiciously like a like like Trump turned into something else. Pre President Ronald Clamp, our records show you have missed your third mortgage payment despite repeated extensions and assurances. While you we understand and sympathize with every homeowner situation, our office feels we have been more than fair in granting you multiple extensions. If you do not pay this mortgage by the due date, we will be forced to foreclose on the property. We hope to resolve this issue with you soon. Oh man, that's a weird that's a weird emoji on there right next to the signature, huh? Dad got fired. That's when he started working for the railroad. Oh, okay. So that's why with the railroad thing. Okay. Although our faculty respects your legacy and dedication, you have been reprimanded more than twice for your aggressive behavior. And with this recent incident involving beer cans in the pool after hours, we feel our only option is to terminate your contract immediately. We're sorry for this situation, but in the interest of safety, we know you. We know you understand that our students always come first. What? We've included a pamphlet with information on resources for alcohol-related issues and hope you find future success. Oh, man. Mm. Dad never told me he had a new... friend. Charles, I'm sorry about what I said the other night. I was just pissed you don't seem to listen to me when I express myself. My job can be very stressful and I know it stresses you out, so that's why I want to be more involved in your world. I hate to see you get so sad when you make me so happy. I'm still waiting to meet your son. I get the feeling you might be ashamed of me. Don't be angry. I hope I'm wrong, but you, but you do say things that hurt my feelings. I care for you in so many ways that I just had to express myself so you understand. I think about you and me together, so I hope you know this message comes from a place of, of, of love in my heart. You're a tiny dancer. Audra, it's a stripper for sure. Stripper for sure. Alright. Let's leave. I think we're good. I'm your tiny dancer. I've never seen Dad get that mad. Uh-oh. It really scares me. What happened? Oh 
man. She loved this song. I haven't listened to it since... for a long time. What song? I long turned time. it off. But what song? Hey. Hey, sports fan. You up for watching the game with your favorite MVP? Sure, Dad. How's the game going? We're kicking their asses. For once. I like it. Cool. I like it when the good guys win. Yep. Me too. Go get the pine tree. Ma did mom watch games? See you later. Go get the pine tree? So, when do you think we'll go get the pine tree? I told you, right after the game. Oh, I thought the game was over. You're not gonna bug me all day, right? No. Sorry. Did mom watch games? Did you and mom watch a lot of games? No. Oh, uh, well, actually, she wasn't a big sports fan. No. Really? Funny, huh? Yeah. But she liked to sit next to me and read. You got that from her. For sure. For sure. That's cool. What did I get from you? Hmm. Attitude. Well, my hero skills, right? Confused. Okay, are we going to tell him we found the play box? Or is that like, hey, I really want the play box? I'm not doing that one, just in case. I get confused by basketball rules. It's like math. You know, but fun. What? You just have to start watching more games. Yeah, just watch Maybe the games. You can get a basketball video game and play together. That's not exactly how you learn to play. But it's a start. See you later. Okay. I'll see you later. I'll let you watch the game now. Yeah, fine. Just get me when it's over. Uh, get ready for the tree. Can we get one that's like 10 feet tall? <laughs> Only if you cut one down, Viking. We might need a bigger castle, too. <laughs> okay, did you did you pause the game? What are you doing? Why does he drink that if it just makes him mad? Damn. All right, let's sit and have a have a think. Why is my dad like watching basketball so much? Oh, okay, we're not. It's oh, already better than the first two. Alright. Oh, he ate all the mac and cheese! Yeah. Hmm, I don't think Dad reads these. I think he just takes them from work. Oh man, that's got a smell, huh? Wait, don't we have a dryer? Maybe some things can't go in the dryer. I can feel the energy flow through me. I have the power! <sighs> do do do. My suit is almost ready. After I get some paint. I like to imagine that there's like a, f a fairly sizable t chunk of chat which is just watching this stream now to see if Life is Strange 2 is in fact going to be worse than, than before the storm. <laughs> there's no way! There's no way it's going to be worse! <laughs> I'm invested. Airball. The hell was that? I just dad to show me again. The shark stinger. Yeah, ref. Oh mm, man, that's a cool shark car. Shark stinger is looking for victims. Look out! Here comes the evil car. Ah! That pedestrian better get out of the way. Oh no, it's truck X. Do nothing. Intervene. That oh. was your last ride, Shark Stinger. Yes, Captain Spirit saved us. You'll never run over anybody again. Damn, I feel bad for Shark Stinger. All right. Let's also watch the game.
remote in the other hand. Yes. Yeah, it's just it's just the same joke over and over. It's like one of my streams. <laughs> At least the forest warrior protect me from the snow ghost. No. All right. I think we can go to the basement now, can't we? Okay, what do we need? Sock. Boo. Boo. How stupid are you? How can you not score here? Yeah, score. Oh, God. I hate going in there. Oh, we're missing something. Alright, what are we missing? We can go outside, can't we? Maybe it's outside. <sighs> Monk does not look like this right now. It's snowing here today. Pretty good. Oh, we have a lot of wood. If you live next to a forest, are you allowed to just go in there and chop a tree down for firewood? Is that something you're allowed to do? Do you need to get a license for that or something or? Depends on the forest. No, you're not. If you own the land, you're allowed. You need landowners for sure. What if no one owns the land? What if it's just like public forest land or whatever? What what is going on right now? Uh go left. You have to have a permit in that case? Okay. I guess it depends. There's going to be huge variance here. Let's go left again. Who made this? Okay, let's go right. You better look at that map again. What map? Oh, we need to know the, the direction to go. Alright, I want to leave then. I'd like to leave. Leave. Alright. Draw Bekoi in the snow. I, I have trouble drawing Bekoi with a fucking mouse on paint, okay? Like, I can't draw a decoy on the snow. Unless... How do I get the, how do I get the 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 feet hairs in? I don't think I can do the I don't think I can do the feet hairs. Alright, let's get let's get Oh you have a tree house? Damn. Are treehouses real? I can't imagine building a treehouse and thinking, yeah, I'd let my kid go up there. 
I can't let Dad find my secret stash. Ever. Okay, of cigarettes? <sighs> Open sesame. My god, beers. I loved watching Mom draw her comics. What are you cooking me, my sweet Valentine? Your favorite dish, pizza. Happy Valentine's Day, sweetheart. Oh, uh, plus two, plus two. All right. Mom received Reddit shooting star for this for this comic. Now I can use this to reveal the full map to my next adventure. All right. Cool. These are my favorite baseball players. Even if I don't understand the stats. Why aren't you into basketball? Harry did say mean things about Dad. But I can't let him see this. Who's Harry? Dear Mr. Erickson, I wanted to let you know that your son Chris got into a small fight with my son Harry Sorber and his friends after school this week. Chris claimed they were saying inappropriate things about you, but Harry is not that kind of child and only knows you through me. As you might know, Harry is an honor student and a decorated boy scout. Maybe you should talk to Chris about his behavior. If this bullying continues, I'll be forced to speak to his school. Sincerely, an asshole. My son, Harry Sorbert. You think he's friends with Rachel Amber? There's my loyal guard, Sky Pirate. Dad keeps telling me this is a girl's doll. So what? Yeah, She's so the what? ice queen. That ain't Elsa. Sorry I destroyed your father. But he was a supervillain. It's true. Yeah. It's true. Old bowl. Oh, here's I had to the real stash. My old cereal bowl after Dad used it for an ashtray. Gross. Oh God, fucking impromptu ashtray is the grossest thing. One time growing up, my sister like blew an ashtray into my face. It wasn't, she didn't know what she was doing. She was really little. I don't blame her for that. But like, oh man, that was a gross day. Just like, just ashes like, like right into my eyes and nose and everything. It was fucking awful. Jimmy Swift. Okay, I think I think we're done. Do you, Joe, do you like the soft boy aesthetic? I don't know what that is, but no. Avril Lavigne. You said this before, Joe. What did I say before? What? The ashtray story? Have I, have I got, like, looped around now? I'm just going to repeat content on a loop? Dad won't face this wing because it's too dangerous to fix. And it probably is. Will you be playing the upcoming Harry Potter game? Uh, I'm not really a big uh, Potterhead, so uh, probably not. But if, if it's good, it's good. We can oh, rebuild him. Answer. This is sad. You used to be a good enemy. Look at you now. How are you supposed to train me to fight Mandroid like that? What can we do? Don't worry, Joe. We'll vote for it in the next voting game. You think there's going to be another voting game? How curious. When are you finally going to play Ultra Kilt? Never. Yeah. 
Smoking Joe. Does have powers. It's like Christmas forever out here. Oh man, good thing we got the key. Oh no, it's Mantroid. It's the mouse. I haven't seen the mouse or his, or his big balls in days, by the way. I think maybe he left. Or he's an X mouse. Big ball. Yeah, he has he has a pair of big balls. He has but yeah. I have it on good authority that rodents, or maybe it's not rodents, maybe it's just, just mice and rats, tend to have large balls. This is where mom went to school before we came here. So I've seen the mouse in the ceiling above my head right now through like plastic film, so I got a good shot of the balls. Took, took two photographs. Dear Mrs. Emily Erickson, as principal of Blackwell Academy, what? I wanted to personally reach out and thank you for your continued support of our art program to our prestigious school. We love displaying your... How many, how many forced references are there going to be in Life is Strange 2? It turns out that Principal Rail Wells survived the, the, the destruction and, and he's hanging out here in this mall. Oh, hey, how's it going? It's me from the first game. How, how's it Work along lists from the other alumni. We all have fond memories of you here. So, oh, she went there. So thank you for thinking of us, and we hope you'll come visit the campus soon and, and see how your contribution keeps our dream alive. I'm going to go to art school because of me. But she was already an amazing artist. Oh, no. Oh, wow. I remember when Mom drew that, and Dad couldn't stop laughing. Good night, good night. Handsome. Honey, you got cold got a cold again. I told you to eat more fruit. <laughs> oh, 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 plus four. Oh my god, plus I four. I don't get this one. I'm too young. Oh. I get it. Now that's a plus two. But not that fragile. Mom and Dad always talked about how they met at school. The jock and the artist. Never judge two books by their covers is the motto of this odd couple from Eugene, each of whom is making local waves in their respective fields and why we're showcasing them in this week's Neighborhood Watch. What? Emily Wyatt is a cartoonist whose witty work about her strange life has been featured in print and the web even in the pages of this paper she hates all sports by her own claims yet is engaged to Charles Erickson how curious a local basketball <laughs> a local basketball star who some say is headed to the Oregon Ducks oh no ironically they met at the library and found true love among the book stacks while helping each other study for their torturous finals I'm math and she's art says a shy blushing Charles Charles clearly a man in love which are actually the same thing from opposite sides as Emily with a warm smile taking her new fiance's hand oh, fucking get a room Jesus Ugh. all right now I can color Captain Spirit just like my drawing. Okay. <gasps> yeah, we're done. <laughs> Fighting danger by moonlight. See 
Yes. Oh, that was kind of neat. Yes, it's actually Captain Spirit to the rescue. And it's time to visit Mantroid's home planet for a change. What do you think the CS stands for? Is that a hole up there? Dad never threw away Mom's hiking boots. Good. Good. All right, what's the combination lock? Okay, it's probably it's probably just that, right? Four two nine four two what nine one. Kind of All right. I trust you, Chatter. No, that's not it. It's not it. Boob. Yeah, it's probably boob. Boob. <laughs> Alright, this was way funnier than I thought it was going to be. That's really funny. Alright, uh, what is the code? I have no idea. Where would it be? <laughs> oh, when, when, did the, when, did, when was this published? Mom and Dad always talked about how they met at school. 2005! Alright, here we go. 2005. It's going to be that. That's the only number around. 2005. Yeah! I can't believe that worked! <laughs> what a fucking basic ass code! Alright, let's. Thanks for storing my explosives, Chief. Whoa! Now I'm ready to rock. Sorry, Dad. Sorry, Dad. Grandma and Grandpa were so nice. I wish we saw them more. Leo was playing, for Christmas they got some Pokemon toys, so Leo was like, they had a, I got him this, uh, a, a Gengar, and the Gengar, it was really cool, I didn't know it did this, if you, if you push down on it, on its feet, um, its tongue would, would stick out, so it was pretty cool, and, uh, they got a Charizard as well, and, like, Leo was sitting there at the table yesterday morning, and he's, like, got the Gengar, and he's, like, he's slamming it so hard, into the into the Charizard's head. It's like he's trying to hammer a nail into the table. Just like just boom, boom, boom. It has no chill this kid. Like <laughs> Dear Charles, thank you for the lovely note and flowers for Kristen's birthday. Who? They always mean more coming from you. We miss you and would love to see how Chris is growing. Like you, we also still miss Emily every day, every hour and minute and second. And we know that grief is part of your life, so uh, always know we think of you often. We're always here for you like you were there for us forever, forever. Please stay in touch and let's make plans to meet soon. Your family and always in our hearts and prayers. Love, Peter. Charizard is ass in OU, by the way. I don't know what OU is. Charizard's a badass Pokemon. What are you talking about? Local woman killed in hit and run. Police are seeking witnesses to a fatal hit and run that occurred on December 16, 2014 at 7.15 p.m. Tuesday night on Mantle Street and Asteroid Drive. The victim, identified as Emily Erickson, 28, of Beaver Creek, Oregon, was apparently... Or is or was the first game in Oregon? I think it was. It was apparently walking from her stranded car when she was struck head-on, applied directly to the forehead, by an unidentified speeding vehicle. She survived by, she survived by a husband and son who were not on the scene at the time. Captain Anderson says that the toll cameras may hold important clues. We're treating this as a case of vehicular homicide. Anybody with information regard Okay, so what it's it's been it's been either a couple days or a year. I'm gonna guess a year? Cause it's December still, right? It's Christmas. Almost Christmas means it wasn't Christmas, so it's got it's got I'm gonna guess it's been a year. I know Dad spent a lot of money on the funeral. Oh, Really? Emily Erickson, 28, beloved wife, mother, and daughter depart our world far too soon on December 16, 2014 in Beaver Creek, Oregon. Emily was born in Eugene, Oregon on January 25, uh, 1986. Oh, shit. Younger than me. To Peter and Kristen Wyatt, a passionate artist since 
kindergarten, she was near the top of her class at Eugene High School, winning various local art competitions and a prize scholarship to the prestigious Blackwell Academy in Arcadia Bay, Oregon. That's from the first game! After graduation, she went back to Eugene and married her college sweetheart, Charles Erickson, on May 1, 2006. Emily and Charles moved to Beaver Creek, Oregon in 2007, where she later began a rewarding career teaching kindergarten and inspiring young people in the arts. Emily and Charles were also blessed with a wonderful son, eh, Chris, born on February 8, 2007. Emily's honest and humorous online comic strips about her family brought her humble recognition. She was survived by her husband, Charles, their son, Chris, and her parents, Peter and Kristen. Funeral services are planned for 12 p.m. December 20 at Eugene Willow Hill Cemetery with a reception to follow. Friends and family are welcome and encouraged to pay their last respects. F. Oh, let's check the license plate. What? I can't go anywhere without the keys. Okay, we're gonna drive. It's not safe out there. Yeah, Dad. I know. Okay, I would kind of just... Oh, would I? I think I would just prefer an invisible wall than if you get there, it makes you turn around. This is annoying. Would I? Hmm. Whoa no there, way. Roach. Well, in Witcher 3, if you get to the edge of the map, you get to use it as a fast travel point. It's a cheeky way to get back in. For family fun, come play with your gun. Clean Harry's Gun Range Holiday. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Kids who lived here before didn't like it. It's true. It's true, though. It's pretty true. All right, we can go see the water eater now. Oh, that's a good shovel. Okay. That snow effect is not well matched to the shovel. Extra bonus points on luck. Do 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 do. Why does this kid work so much for his deadbeat father? Jesus, that's kind of a trope, isn't it? Like the, the good kid. Like you can never have like a good father and a good kid. It always has to be like one's bad. Not the best trope. Nan yeah, like Nanako and, and whatever his name was. The kind of thinking fucks me up, actually. Like, usually when something good happens to me, I think, alright, so what's the bad thing that's gonna happen to balance this out? <laughs> it's not fun. <laughs> alright, let's go to the basement. Come on, don't be afraid. Go in there and turn on the heat. But first, put on your magic cape. Uh-oh. Home alone time. I think I'm not alone. That looks kind of weird. It's still 
a nicer basement than the one, than the one you I'm have in the right power, now. Captain Spirit, you have the power. Water eater. No more fear. I have to face this monster. The city needs hot water. Oh, it was in his head the whole time. Oh, damn. Yes. Yeah, we did it. Oh, wait, the room's tiny. I thought it was going to be like a... Oh. Well, that wasn't too hard. Okay. I tame the water beast. All right, cool. Let's finish washing the dishes. No? Okay. You left the eggs out. What are you doing? Uh oh, is he asleep? Uh oh. McReady? <gasps> Are we McReady's kid? Oh god, I hope so. Okay, I don't know why we turned the water heater on. All right, what else is there to do? Uh, the treasure map. Dangerous beer cans. Time for Captain Spear to put these pieces together. It's all coming together. Okay, uh, this doesn't look right. Mm, I have to place it right. All right, I'm all out of options. It's over here. There's no way it's over here, is it? Yeah, that's not it. All right, what else? Oh, it's down here. One of them has to be right. Maybe they don't. It's gotta be around the house, right? That looks about right. This one. No. Joe why am I being Joe'd? Why am I being Joe'd? What's 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 with the Joeing going on? Why am I being Joe'd? Okay, that's the one. All right, there the we treasure go. Treasure map is not secret anymore. All right, they're it's they're mine. arrowheads. All right, I did it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let, give me a second. All right, so we go left, left. No, left, right, left, left. Is that it? Because one, two, three, four. Left, right, left, left. I think that's it. Left, right, left, left. All right, let's go. Right, left, right, left. All right, there we go. Damn, where are we gonna find in here? I'm so, I'm so excited. All right, we go right first. Right, left, right, right. Right, left, right, right. Left. Right. Left. 
left again. Alright, this is it. We did it. My god, a new area. Man, look at these weebs donating coins to the start the race challenge thinking it's actually gonna happen. Look at these weebs falling for the bait. I forgive you, mother. I can hear you. The weeb has fallen for the waifu bait. I mean, if you guys get it down, then I have to do it, but you know. It's never gonna happen. Yes, every road leads to an end. Your apparition passes through me in the willows and five red hands. You'll never see us again. Who's the boss? You'll never see us again. I'm glad this is here, or else I wouldn't never have guessed he misses his mom. Who's Rachel Amber, by the way? <laughs> what even is the race? Was it like a mo race or something? So chatters can start the race or also buy a marble, and those 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 points will go towards starting the race. And once the race is started, all the marbles that have been purchased will be Almost put in a race me. for anime. And a small smile. They're all anime marbles, and whichever one wins is the anime I will watch. Possibly on stream, with like timestamps or whatever, because, you know, copyright. So show up to every stream and, and put your coins in. Put your drop in the bucket that is the ocean. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, that was it? Okay. Can we put non-anime marbles in? No, it is an it is an anime marble race. Okay, let's phone him. Call call dad. Who's Reynolds? Oh hoy hoy. What if I never participate in the bet? Can I get a discount more? I already gave out my free, my free, hey Joe, can I have a marble? And then I just did it for the lols Lamayo marble. We already did that. No. Think of a new joke. And maybe you can cheat your way into a free marble. Hey Reynolds. Come on. Hello? Mrs. Reynolds? H hello? Okay? That was weird. I don't get it. Ooh, pizza. We can't afford pizza. Buongiorno. Bava's Pizzeria is closed, but if you can wait, our business hours are Tuesday through Sunday, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. If you would like to leave a message for Augusto, please do so. Pizza? Ciao. Okay. Okay, we did that already. Need to unlock dad's phone. Alright, let's go get the tree. Dad, you, you sleeping? Oh, you drank the whole bottle? Hey, wake up. Dad, come on. Huh? What? Who's there? Who's that? Dad, it, it's just me, Chris. Whoa, whoa, hold on, buddy, okay? Jesus. My my dad got so blackout drunk once that I couldn't wake him up. 
and when I say I couldn't wake him up, I mean like, and I I was like a teenager. Okay, I wasn't a kid. I was a teenager. So let's give you the context. Like, I couldn't wake him up. Like, I was going like this to his face, like full force slapping him across the face, and I could not wake him up. <laughs> That's how fucking blackout drunk my dad was. I can't, like, I still don't, I don't even understand it as an adult how someone could be that fucking asleep. <laughs> Fuck! Dad, are you okay? Do I look okay? More, yeah, it's no, pretty morbid. I don't think it's so I'm pretty bored. Goddamn game. <sighs> Fuck! Uh oh. That's just great. I was drinking that oh, booze. I sprain my foot. Chris, why did you wake me up? This is a tree. You, you told me to wake you up. I thought, I thought you said the pine tree. <sighs> pine tree? I can't even walk in my own house, man. You should be careful when you're, you know, when you wake up. Don't be a smart ass, Chris. I'm not in the mood right now. Yeah, Chris. Yeah, Dad. Okay. It's game day. Pizza? Jesus Christ, who is that? Go answer. If it's some salesperson or some church group, you just close the door on them. It's nobody's business. This is our castle, and it's our family. Right? If I provide you with three good reasons why you should give me a free marble, will you do it? Oh, no, that's actually pretty... That's actually... That could be fun. No, we're not doing right. that. Nope. You're not getting a marble out of me. No. Uh oh. Who the hell are you? Oh my, look at you. What kind of costume is that? Nanya. I'm Captain Spirit. Of course you are. We need all the superheroes we can get. Okay. This is sus as fuck. How are you doing, Chris? Good, Mrs. Reynolds. Oh, it's Mrs. Reynolds. Just I just called you just and it was weird. Just video game. Could just clean the house. Clean the house. Just you know, cleaning up the house and stuff. On a beautiful Saturday like this, you should be playing instead. I even saw you clearing the snow out of the. Okay, sorry. I'm I'm conf I'm still a little confused. What, what was the the heavy breathing on the phone? Was that just like a, like a, like a epic Star Wars reference, Mei Mei? Like what was that? I don't understand what that was. Am I supposed to understand what that was? How many subs do I need to gift for a free marble? No, we're not doing that. I'm not I'm not selling marbles with subs. We're not that scummy. No one knows. It's snoring, maybe. Okay. Ellie, so I hope you don't work all day. Well, it's laundry day. Laundry day. Dad's watching the game, so... So, it's your job to clean the house? N no. Actually, I was going for a nice walk, and I thought I heard a loud noise over here. Mind your own business. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. We didn't, we didn't hear. We didn't hear anything. Yeah, of course. We didn't hear a noise. Are you sure? Lordy, I thought, I don't know, but it was loud. And there's no other houses around. You probably heard me and my dad watching the game. He kind of go crazy, so. Hmm. You're not the only one. I love the game. I've had a I couple brewskis myself. Things. All right, yeah. Okay, leave. I hope you have something else planned for today. Oh my God, go! Buy a pine tree. Work on the tree. We're going to buy a pine tree. Oh, yeah. Tree. Me and my dad are going to go buy a real pine Christmas tree. Oh, that sounds like fun. Stephen and I better get one so we can start decorating. Who? Oh, I love this time of year. Me too. And Dad said we could get the best Christmas tree on the lot. You certainly deserve the best Christmas tree. And if you need any extra decorations, we have a surplus. Ooh, that would be awesome. Well, I'm glad to see you're taking care of your father. Of course. We're both father. on the same team. 
You're a good son, Chris. Okay, ominous. Listen, Chris. Let me take you away. I'm only steps away from your house. What are you doing? If you ever feel scared, you can come visit us anytime, day or night. Understand? We here for you. Okay. Okay. Sure. Thanks. Thanks, Claire. I promise I'll see you later. Claire? I don't care for Claire. So what did that nosy bitch want? Face. Oh, nothing, huh? I was listening. I heard it all. Well, then you know. Why you asking? Rid of her. No, I couldn't have. I tried. Man, I bet you wanted to tell her what a shitty dad you have. Huh. No, she just wanted to say hi. I didn't say anything, Dad. I swear. Uh-oh. Dad, please believe me. Another bruise? Jesus. Stop that whining. You're not a baby anymore. Uh-oh. Boo-hoo, Daddy. Believe me. Grow up. But I... You're just... Just like your mom. Every time I look at you, every time you talk... Stop it. I, just, just, I see your face. Why? And if it wasn't for you, she would have never taken the car that day. Never. Oh, damn. Holy shit. This guy is, like... Almost half as bad as Joyce is apparent. God damn. Oh, hey, Chris, look, hey, I didn't mean that, buddy. Yeah, you did. Yes. Yes, you did. No, listen, Chris. <laughs> you don't have your coat or your boots. Oh, no. Better or worse than Dejima? Well, he's home, so, you know. Uh-oh. Is this for real, or did he just die? Is this gonna cut to him being in the ICU in a second? Like, like what? what is this? Oh my god, I just saw what happened. Who the fuck are you? Hey, hi, yeah, I can fly. To be continued. The awesome adventures of Captain Spirit. Uh, okay. Thank you, chat. This was really worth playing before we start Life is Strange 2. Dear Santa Claus, I think I've been good. Here's my oh, the list, okay. It was two guys. Life is Strange 2, guys. Better than before the storm. Of course, yeah, of course it was better than before the storm. Did he actually fly there at the end, or? Oh, I think I know what just happened. All right. I think I know what happened. All right, can we skip? By Life is Strange 2. I did it. Meet Chris again. Is Life is Strange? I did it already. I did. I did. I did it. I got it. I did it. Nonfiction. I did it already. 
It's the other cast. But yeah, it's it's. Uh, I I thought for a bit that we were that we were the kid from the game that I saw, but then as soon as I saw the kid at the end, I'm like, I think that's him instead. So like it's it's that he stopped him from falling, not that he could suddenly fly or whatever. Okay. Um. All right. Let's exit game. Do, 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 do. Man, viewers just went up by like 300 people as soon as we were done with this. Time for the for the real life is strange too. Movie trailer is over. Break, please. I need what? Yeah, we're gonna take a break. Don't worry. I just want to get the game started up. Oh man, my contacts bother me again. This is happening a lot lately. It feels like once every three times my contacts are bothering me. Can I get a free marble if my entry is don't watch any anime? They said, well, that's just implied. We don't need a marble for that. Everyone knows that. All right, life is strange too. All right, press any button. All right. Okay, we is this gonna start us again from the, will this show the, I guess we'll find out when we get back. All right, so we're just gonna go here, right? The skip feature has been improved. Aw, oh, bless him. You can now select the skip cinemax on a completed episode. Set this alternate mode and control setting as well. Okay. So if we hit like continue or new game or whatever, it'll just we'll just hit we'll just hit a uh, new game when we get back. All right, I'm gonna go Pete. Be back in like five minutes.
Okay, I think I got it. I think I think the breathing is is that is that she's she, so that's probably gonna be like we we that's a chapter somewhere, right? I bet you that Claire Reynolds is an evil Claire Reynolds, and she likes to kidnap kids and like like put like a gag on them, but like but still give them a phone, so she they can like in range of a phone, so they can answer the phone. And just kind of breathe creepily into the phone whenever someone calls. So, like, evil enough to, to trap them, but nice enough to give them a phone. Th that's got to be it. Claire X? Yeah, Claire X, yep. Alright, evil dogs. Alright. <laughs> Joe, you watch too much Robot Poli? What do you mean, Robot Poli? Robo Car Poli? You don't know. Will you stream on Friday? Uh, I think we have something going on on Friday. But I probably will, but it might be a little later. A little later start. Love mixed or hate Captain Spirit? Uh, I don't... Indifferent? <laughs> it was just... It was whatever. Alright. Alright. Life is Strange 2. Here we go. New game. I think you can turn on copyright music in the game settings on home or sure though. Let's see. Audio. Mute licensed music. Yeah. Alright. I'm glad that we have to do that. Gaming. Alright. New game. <sighs> Sorry, new game. We'll erase your current save file. Proceed. Yes. No import choice again or anything? Okay. What did we go with again? Arcadia Bay is destroyed. Yeah, that's a more interesting one to continue on, I think. This is weird, the jumping around. Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. Oh no, I'm not a 1010. Not a 1010. October 26, 2016. Alright, so in soon we will be somewhere snowy. Oh no. Some scenes in this are so awkward that music sounds like a, a meme to me. Hey, David Cage. Oh, I'm really tired today, sorry. Didn't sleep well the past two days. Oh, was there supposed to be music here? Seems like it. Aw, oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> so awkward! your step. See you tonight. Don't be late, losers. Yeah, losers. Is that the okay, true colors girl? You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Okay. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Nice. Classic Dude, line. Yeah. We talked about this. What? 
Could you full, have any less works? game? <sighs> yeah. I'm no good at this. Ooh, What's wrong with that? Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> God, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Oh, now we know okay, her name. Just, just Lila. Don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hi, whore. Oh, Going to the party tonight? Said. Too late. <laughs> <laughs> Would be awesome to see you there. Oh, man, that's what? so much better. I could have texted that. Yeah. It's a good start. She'll text back. You'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, uh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud. Why does she have, like, wasted. dildos on her, like, yes, backpack Sean, straps? You just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's gonna be there. Wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a ten year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you oh, should now be I know his name. It's Sean. Me. Oh, it's Jen. Oh, Same now name. I know this Jen. I can't wait to see us at the party. What? Jen, Lila, really? and Sean. Oh, damn! I'm getting so <laughs> yes. many names. Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Wait, but she texted hmm. you. So. Okay, are you gonna like? So what should I work tonight? Are you gonna like oh, go on. after her together? Oh, ha ha! Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? <laughs> how, how will they ever recover from that bird? <laughs> Holy shit, you murdered the- The fuck up, dickhead. <laughs> Oh no! Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. It's Always good true to himself. Boy Chloe! <sighs> oh. That skull is not gonna fit through there. Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. Who wants a yard couch? Gets wet and then it's gonna get a lot of like. Infested with something? Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Busted. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? What? Take one. Refuse. Mm, nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know. Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, now I'll I know he's a track this star. When you're begging for a spliff tonight. Man, look at all the information we're getting from this this wonderful zero exposition dialogue. I know that the I know her name's Lila. I know his name's Sean. I know that he's a track star. I know that they just came back from the loony bin and that they're lovebirds. I'm getting so much information. Speaking of weed. I got the Looney bin is what we call dollar stores, by the way, up here in Canada. Cover tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. <laughs> yeah. Hey, whoa! What the hell are don't you doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. What? First, we need money for supplies. Really? No, I just made that up. I'm, 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 I'm unreasonably proud. <laughs> I'm sure some Canadian has made that joke before, but I'm really proud. All right. <laughs> Munchies, <laughs> chips, and dip. Can we look at the soda, at the hand? Etc. All right. This better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. The booze. Can probably snag a six pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All right. Blankets. Coffee of Witcher get Three. So chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D O. Oh, stop! You're out of room, punk. It's just a smiley face. You. It's just. Is it that? That's that's a penis. That that's a penis. 
that's a penis. Is this how you see a penis? <laughs> Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You for real? Go down that road, dude. What? My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> yeah, wish. ten times yours. Okay, why are these two banging? I don't understand. What's the dynamic here? Oh, oh, shit, it's a plane. Planes, man. Oh, man. Hope the air oh, traffic controller is having a good day. I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. What? Shit changes so fast. What? I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Yeah. Will you still be my BFF? No. Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Oh, man. Always be friends. No as possible. What? <laughs> No es posible, sister. With all that shit going on, dirty Mexican like me hanging out with an Asian chick? Huh. I mean, that's a one-way ticket to jail. Oh, I'm not worried. You'll be pacing your ass off behind that wall way before me. <laughs> shit, you're right. I need to get cooler than you. So my 10,000 followers keep me out of trouble. Okay. I mean, no way you can. Now I know he's Mexican and she's Asian. Thank you so much. But... I love you anyway. The hits keep coming, man. The hits keep coming. Love you too, okay. sister. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Skype? Hugs. Talk to you soon. Skype? Hello, Friday night. Yep. Friday, Friday. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure. I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. It's true. You're really supported right now. You're welcome. true. And yep. now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz. Then we're gonna presiding sneeze. over the case of the last Choco. Phew. <coughs> Sorry. I, oh no. I have to go uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So, well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or... Did the dad just say don't be a snitch to his own son who is snitching to him about his other son? This dad's fucking based. What the hell? Whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week yeah. Or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, shh, shh. Let him decide. Judge? Okay. The verdict, please. God, I hope the butterflies show up. You're both guilty. Senor Diaz wins. Daniel is innocent. All right, I don't know what any of these mean. All right, let's go with that one. Daniel was guilty of being a brat. So the Choco Crisp goes to Senor Diaz. What? No way. You're a cheat. <laughs> nope. I'm the law. Your Honor, I can't let you punish an innocent man. So? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I always knew you'd confess. Okay. Back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. Back to school. And you better play nice together. Like you always do. I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. Now this is Life is Strange, too. All right, what's the writing okay. in the bottom left? Let's get this party list started. Yeah. Better pack for the party. Oh, man. NSFW. Uh, what? 
Hunt for munchies. Find drinks for Eric's party. Ask dad for some money. Find a blanket. In case you need help with math. Jen, Jen's note. She actually helped me a few weeks ago. She's really cool. Oh, it's Jen Amber. I never go anywhere without water. This fall has been pretty dry so far. That's true. I, I never go anywhere without water too. I haven't been to the park for a month. When it starts raining, it'll be too late. Dad's lighter. I love this old lighter from when dad was a kid. He wouldn't like it that much if he knew the actual reason I keep it with me though. <sighs> he knows. Don't worry. I'll try not to lose this one tonight like I did at the last party. 320. What, what does that mean? That's how much money you have? Best company for a lonely school bus ride. USB key. It's been in there for months. I don't even remember what's on it. ID card. Is there a universal law stating we have to look like morons on our official papers? What do you mean? You look fine. Sean Eduardo? Eduard? No. No, I think it said Eduardo, right? Diaz? Two thousand. Lila says I look like my dad. Guess that's a compliment. Yeah, your dad's pretty hot. I feel like we've been living here for a lifetime. Ten years already. Same kind of toy the kid was playing with. Phone charger. I better bring it to the party just in case. I need to charge your phone. Statistics and you. Only one more year, then no more math. Pencil case. I can't believe I've had this thing since 8th grade. Don't be bullied. Anti-bullying flyer. They keep handing these out in school, but they always end up in the trash. If you're the victim of bullying, you're not alone. Alright. E.M. Anderson. Fantasy book. I wish this was the kind of book we had to read in class. Chronicles of the Basilisk. Oh man. Let's read it. We can't. I hate these multiple choice questions. I always guess wrong. Test C+. Eh, it's still passing. Alright, what's up here? Journal. Oh no. God, is anyone in the series not an artist? This looks familiar. Why does this look familiar? Hi son, I hope you'll work wonders with this new sketchbook. I'm sure you will. That is, if you're not too lazy to get to it. I remember your very first drawing was of me. Now you can... Now can you beat my skillful portrait of you? Okay, right. I'll leave the art to you and go back to my engines. Feliz cumpleaños. 16 for 2016. Love you, your papi. Labor fucking day. Ch Chef Diaz breaks out the final grill of summer. Le fashion. Baseball is for losers. Hi, dad. I can see you. This one was a real pain in the ass today. Duh. All right. I am not a PETA. Spacey Stacy. Oh man, I know her mom. Jen. Thank God for Lila and her silly jokes. Some big gorillas vibes right now. Buy new wheels. Ollie Ollie oxen free motherfuckers. Alright, that's actually pretty funny. That's a plus two from me. Sun Sunday gamey Sunday. Misty Mice and Ghoul Days. That guy was such a dog, lol, am I right? Sharon, that's fucking racist. Okay. American Horror Debate 2016. So glad I was baked. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. L, what the fuck's wrong with... Okay, you know what? I don't care. <laughs> Hold on, let's read our text messages. <sighs> no practice today, team. Copy that. Alright, so just, just a bunch of, like, you're on the track team bullshit. Alright. Adam. I'm ready to frag. Okay. What's it? Adam's, like, what, 28? Like, what, what's this shit? Boss, we need you. Sean, can you come in at 3.30 today? Hey, boss. Yes, you're my hero. I owe you. How about a raise? Bad connection. See you at 3.30. Oh, base boss. All right, so just just basic work stuff. You there? You see my Facebook post? No, it's 4.20. <sighs> I'm chilling with light at the park. Blaze it, bro. Check it out, stoner. This is so hard to, like... Is it, like... Can I finesse it? Like... 
All right, you want you won something. My parents just sent it to me to, to, to the last race. Great shot. All right, you have no game. All right, uh, Lila. Oh my God! Hey, wake up! You'll not believe what just happened. Do not ghost me. Boo. Okay, I can't. I can't. It's so okay. Can I just use the mouse? Okay, there we go. Nice try, but I'm a Ghostbuster. I hate you. Guess what just happened? No, you are a dick. That's what she said. 2010 called and wants its meme back. Thin Ice? We have to talk. Are you home? Yeah, but whacked. Track then work. Lame. Don't be a hater, girl. I said see you later, girl. Let me just eat something, then I'm all yours. Okay, Skype later. What is this? The Skype is just like, it's it's a thing. Ready to grind tomorrow? What are we doing? Got my new wheels, boy. See you at the park. It's me, boy. I'm the PS5. Be there at 4. I'll I be there at 3, smiley face. Want to come watch the new episode of my place? I just DL'd it. What new episode? What show? Doctor Who? I'm at work tonight, sorry. Why do you have to work? So I can buy you a Misty Mice ticket for your B-Day. Sorry. What? Stop. No way. Wait. Oh my god. I love you. Now I remember why you're, you're my BFF. La friend zone? You deserve it. Sometimes. You're still at work? Sadly. Need help with fucking stats. Uh-oh. Epic Skype ahead. <laughs> Fucking hell. But Lila Hawking is here to save me. Is her last name actually Hawking? It's life. It's a Life is Strange game, so it probably is. Shit. Douche customer wants another mocha. Talk tonight. Is it Step Douche? Okay, don't forget me. Don't forget me. Hey, what? You suck, okay? You go into the big game? Oh, it's game day. We're drinking. Fuck that noise. Our team blows. Anna wants to go. She likes the tight ends. Yes, she would. So you no go? Dude, track is enough jock for me. So be a jock of all trades. Ha 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 ha. Stop. Come on. If I have to go, so do you, please. Hello, I sent you a YouTube link. Watch it. Fuck you, my eyes are bleeding now. Ha 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 ha. You are so late, so busted. Too tired after last night? You're a fault stoner. And I had to take Daniel to school. Aw, uh, bring my boo here. Yeah, I'm so on that. Should I tell him Mr. Ellis Ellison you be late? Tell him to fuck off. I got an ODE to skip first period. What's that? What's an ODE? Official dad ex Okay, thank you. Alright, thank you. Thank you. What is? Why is your dad so damn cool? Please adopt me. No way, you eat too much. You'd ruin us in tacos. But I love tacos. I love tacos too. Yes, I pissed- I pissed you. Yes, I pissed you. Okay? Put down the bong, I don't get it. I am pissed at you. Okay. I, I understand now. Why? I told you why. When? When I get there. Now? Hello? Happy birthday to you. You're almost a real adult. What are you trying to say? And it seems like you, like you had a very adult booze last night. Don't handle me, please. Momster made me go to her sister's house so bored I got loaded on my cousin. Now I feel like poop. 17 candles gone wrong. I lived, bitch. You need to detox. Right, coach. Thanks for the input. I will detox just after my misty mice tonight. Hey, we gonna... We gone rock the late bar. Can't wait. Let me just swallow my weight in Tylenol, then go Skype to make a plan. Lost my voice as expected. Now I can't Skype. Best B-Day night ever. Thanks again, bro. Love you. Heart. Hey, do you know Jen Murphy? Asking for a friend. Oh my god, I so knew you'd be into her because she looks just like me. Stop. She's super cute and nice. I'll hook you two up. Smiley cool face. Stop. Lila, do not say anything to her. If you don't, if you, I don't, you won't. Dude, hell, this, look at the scroll. Hello? Jen just asked me to remember my class. Would you tell her that you're a loser, but she's into losers. Seriously, what did you say? Damn chill. I wanted to do this. You hang out. Sorry to care. Oh, fuck. Not my job. Are you actually mad? Do you text Jen? No, I will. When? Soon. Don't punk out, bitch. Dude, missed the bus again. Did Lipton take take roll? What? No, like, yeah, I told him you were too high. Thumbs up. Dude, JK, JK told me you might be at track. Uh, Cool face. Thanks. That's almost true. I'm running. Won't even have to fake the sweat. You gross. Holla. You called. Hi, Lila. Lila, 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 Daniel, yes, what are you doing? Talking to my fave Diaz. Ha ha ha, little shit took my phone. Be nice to my boyfriend or I'll kick your ass. Did, did you watch the freak show? Of course we did. My dad's so mad he asked me for a puff. I'm drowning myself in dank memes. Whoa, not bad either. Fuck the shit, I'm going to bed. Okay, girl, don't think too much. I'll try, thanks. Seriously, ho, he's not going to win, right? Don't know, man. I'd oh, for fuck's sake. No! No! Oh, that was like a fucking jump scare at the end of this text message! What the fuck? Holy shit! What a twist ending! Fucking... What the fuck? Jesus Christ! I'm mad! Alright, fucking... Air, uh, I'm done. I'm done. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. Really? That's cool. Yeah, is it though? Man, is there any more boring sport than baseball? 
But jeez, how old is this? We've had it since I was ten. It's a it's a pumpkin. What do you mean? I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but <laughs> not tonight. Fucking Top Gear. <laughs> what if Jen came over? Mm, we can build a fire and, <sighs> dude, stop. I don't know who plays more, Daniel or, or me. Dad. Oh, or me. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. Who the fuck is Noah? Leftovers. Dad, clean up. What are you doing? Dad hates sushi. Me too. But he orders it anyway for us. Great, Dad. I'm not that into cars, but these are pretty bitching. Oh, they're fucking bitching for sure. Hella bitching. Alright, time to sit and think. Man, I'm sure so happy I get to live here. You know, sometimes things are tough, but I have if a great dad. things go well, should I bring Jen back here? Maybe dad won't like her, or she won't like him. Or worse, she can get along with Daniel. Dude, stop. I'm not even dating her. This music, man, I just keep expecting Bowie to start seeing ground control to Major Tom. Seriously. Alright, let's go. Do not enter. Ever. Yep. Dad's need their privacy. Dad, I yep. won't. Dad's need their privacy. Especially when they're watching Lord of the Rings. Oh, let's go see the water eater. I need uh -oh. to take care of- Alright, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? That you, Sean? It's me, Daniel. Ye uh, which one am I again? Oh, I'm- uh, I'm- uh, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Don't get too excited, kid. You're okay. making me nervous. Hey. I need some money. Since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure. Top red Candy. drawer. Top red drawer. Oh, it's, it was behind me. Um, there's no wrench here. Lameo got uh, him. Shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. <laughs> Chupacabras from outer space? Flex Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi for him. How's his leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Okay, what is the 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 Nickelodeon era show? Okay, I don't have any punchline for this. I just, I just, this just reawoke a memory of mine, and I want, I want to know what show it is. What's the Nickelodeon era show, like Dexter's Lab or something like that, where there was an episode where they kept saying like they're camping, and it's like, oh no, El Chupacabra might be out there, and every single time they said it, a bunch of sheep would just appear and go, meh. What, what was, was that Dexter's Lab or was it like Doug or whatever? Someone's got to know. Someone out there's got a note. Cow and Maybe it was Cow and Chicken. It's got to be one of those. Laszlo? I don't know what Laszlo is. Bill and Mandy? Billy and I've never heard of Billy and Mandy. Dexter's Lab was on Cartoon Network. Bro, Nickelodeon era. Like, that era of, like, like, like you know, the Cartoon Network and some other networks there can be in other two. Era means a time, not the channel. Courage the Cowardly... Maybe it was Courage... No, I don't think it was Courage the Cowardly Dog. It's Dexter. I think it's Dexter too. It was Dexter's Lab. Damn, I remembered it. Nice. All right, that's it. It beats the alternative. Okay, is this it? Breaking Bad? All right, are we going to just... Are we going to, like, grab everything? Give tool. Hey. I got it. This isn't it. I think. Nope. Hmm. Nope. Wrong size. Okay. I need a 16 millimeter. All right. Well, okay. Well, this is going to take a while. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, 
Yeah. I got a B. A B? But oh, you were so confident one. about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Calloway is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. Oh, my fucking God. I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow a fucking gasket. <sighs> the is I can't amazing. even keep up the troll hey, now. You don't gotta tell me. Tell her. Yep. Next parent teacher meeting? Yep. Mm -hmm. She's getting a piece of my mind. Uh huh, yeah. About Vonnegut, yep. Prick. Here you go. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it. It's so a it change its direction. Is this bonding? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Not that one. Okay. Is it that one? I don't know enough about cars and their tools. Here you go. Let's see if it's this one. Is that it? Yes. Okay. This is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, okay. yeah. Let's All get right, down just to let me business. Tighten this. Isn't Vonnegut your favorite writer? Nah, he's up there though, so, but he's not my favorite. Finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, I need some money. Yeah. A nice um, skateboard. Sure. I know it's not your thing. But you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering. I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. What's the point? You always say that. But for what? <laughs> so you deadbeats can take care of me when I retire. <laughs> You'll never retire. Someday. This is a good dad. Maybe back to Mexico. Back to Puerto This is a good dad, and they seem like good kids. So... It's not looking good, dad. Oh, I've heard this one before. Hmm... I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Whoa, you're getting a car? You don't have to. It's wicked. Ugh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. Wicked. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. Whoa. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock-blocking is. Oh, we're just, up to you, we're just saying that, Try huh? Okay, all right. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um... <sighs> okay. By the way... Ha! Huh. I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Right. Ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. A hundred dollars. using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Yeah. Yeah, probably. Um, I mean... Yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Yeah, this is a good dad. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah. Why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. I can buy you for more weed. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. Did you party a lot? When you were my age, did you party a lot? Oh, <laughs> hell yeah. You have no Sorry. idea. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home. Would you? All right. Are we going to go to Mexico Thanks, later Dad. and suddenly there's hey, going to be hey, a yellow hey. filter already thing? Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Hug? Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, sure. Do I get another 40 bucks? Uh, okay, have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. 
Bye. Love you. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood. Even though he won't tell. The saw almost took my thumb off once. Remember, if you want Breaking Bad at its yellow fucking salt shaker shows that, that Walt is obsessed with meth even during this dinner conversation with Skyler, you have to accept it at the yellow Mexico piss filter whenever they're down there, okay? You can't have it you no can't have it one way but not the other. Fireworks after last year. If your 16-year-old son asked for beer and weed money, what would you do? Well, weed's legal up here. I don't know if it's legal for a 16-year-old, though. I'd probably be okay with it, but it depends on the kid. Dad's had this forever. I'm glad he doesn't make us go- Damn. You can Oops. open a hardware store with all of this. Running the garage was Dad's dream. I'm proud of him. Honestly. I can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Tagging? Well, of course. He asked Daniel too. Alright. So Life is Strange has two different kinds of characters. Alright, cool. Definitely going to need major snacks for the party. Dad should just sell that other bike. Water eater. Ski stuff. Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. Gonna get baked on Mount Baker. How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Daniel destroyed our old nativity scene. Sorry, baby Jesus. <laughs> I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. All right. Hey, Lila. My blanket sense is uh, tingling. You ready for the party yet? Answer or I'll take your hot dad. All right, you guys didn't text for nine days? Is it just, just non-stop Skyping? Okay, why aren't we answering? All right. Damn, Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. Dad flips out if I don't pick up my stuff, but Danny leaves his shit all over. Yeah, Daniel's nine. Different different rules for for different ages. Although nine is definitely old enough to, to, to fucking clean up. Like, what are you doing? Daniel, clean up. Angry note. Dear loser. That's right. Get them there. I don't know what that means. Mr. Diaz, your property line overhangs on mine and your children are loud and won't stay on their side. I have told you many times to build a legal proper fence no higher than six feet according to Seattle land use code between our two properties and you have not done it yet. I know my rights as you... Why don't you build it? I know my rights as a U.S. citizen. Maybe you don't. And I expect you to also follow the rules. If you do not build a, prop a proper fence, then I might take you to small claims court for damages. Your neighbor, Scott Von Foster. SVF. Okay. It's nice going jogging with Dad every once in a while. Just, just build a fence, Lamayo. Oh, he's way too chatty. Is that a metaphor or something? Nah. Dad tries so hard to get on a healthy diet. I can't wait for him to be on Instagram. Add money. Real funny, Dad. Drug money. Add money. Ten dollars. Steal money. I'm not stealing any money. Although I am buying drugs. Hmm. I am buying... No, no, I'm not going to take anything. Meet the Diaz. Organization experts. Okay. I don't think that was read properly. Corn syrup. What the? Is Dad baking something? He's hitting the syrup. He's back on the syrup. Oh, no. Yo, 
dad's secret recipe fucking rules actually home alone past the delight okay first of all you have to kill macaulay culkin bava bow type pasta boil water don't let it get soft thanks amazing father for recipe all right cool sounds delicious i'm so hungry pitcher <laughs> daniel kept saying i'm freezing but we couldn't get him off the skis What should we on games tackling subjects like real world racism and just giving the message racism is bad as it hurts people without presenting possible solutions and such? Um, I mean, I kind of don't like it because games can barely tell a competent story as it is. So tackling a, a topic like that that is as that needs to be handled with more maturity than most seems like a a bad idea. Beer, can I take the beer? <laughs> Man, Daniel could live off this crap. Close it. Ted doesn't drink that much. Okay. Are we Does really he keep track? I don't. I think we should buy the beer. I don't think we should take the beer. Can I just? Don't forget the non-booze. Okay. Can I take that? This will work. All right. I'm taking that. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. Oh, did Disco Elysium have a good commentary on racism? I don't remember it having that much on, on racism. It had a little... It, it like flirted list. with it with some characters, Drinks didn't it? Down, food to go. But it was more like some people are racist rather than let's talk about racism. There were at least two characters I remember talking about it a bit. I bet there's some junk in the kitchen I can grab. At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. Racist lawyer. Driver. Yeah, him and um, the guy that uh, kept saying Al Cool. I can't remember anyone else. There's probably a racist cop route, though, too, right? Please solve the following fun, ma fun problems. Adam had 10 boxes and 19 balls each. He lost two balls. How many balls does he have now? It's too hard for me. Too hard for me. I love how it's always like people and things. <laughs> Frank had 55 donuts, you know? Damn. The guy never stops working. Will Dad actually take us there one day? <laughs> Doubt it. Perto Lobos? Looks nice. He was so proud to get that. He should be. Sean. Bear's lair. My room. Toothbrushes. Daniel better not use my toothbrush again. Uh-oh. Hey, Jen. What's up? Oh, try up, again, Jen? loser. Hey, you look totally hot. Oh my god, stop. Oh. Hey, you wanna share my blanket? Hey, Jen. Do you wanna hang out sometime? Not bad. Remember, don't be too thirsty. All right. Well, it's not my turn to do the laundry. Remember your training. I like showers like this. Not a bad bathroom. Uh, let's go see our brother. Oh, damn. The grub. 
How many times have I watched it? Not enough. The Grub Father? Harv, yo Diaz, I hear you're gonna tap Murphy's ass. Um. Okay. I don't know who you are or, or who that is. Asshole. This was such a cool day. Can't wait to go back out there with the crew. The crew? We almost got caught by a crazy old dude. But it was such a blast. Alright, is that Rachel Amber? Man, there is nothing less cool to me than flipping the bird. Like, th there's just nothing badass about it to me. Whatsoever. I really like that one. <laughs> it can be funny, totally suck. for sure. That's a good picture, I like it. Thanks, Daniel. I'll, uh, treasure this gift always. Also pretty good. Alright, let's sit and think. Sit down and draw. Alright, let's draw a gen. I will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. Yeah. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Okay, what, what's, what's the subject? The light! Hold and observe. Alright, we're gonna be doing this a lot. Time to take the pen, dude. Time to take the pen. Do 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 Alright, where's the pen? Okay, I'm confused. Hope I won't mess oh. up too much with the proportions. I did this already and it didn't do anything. Do I have to be looking down at it or? The lighting is nice. It's been a while since I've sketched my room. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. I guess it's because I wasn't looking down. <sighs> okay. Got it. Man, I really feel like I'm drawing right now. My room almost looks cool on this. Not an easy task. <laughs> Good job. Oh, okay. Well, I'm having fun. Achievement unlocked. Sketchy. Yeah, we're sketchy as hell. I think I know what to ask for Christmas. For star annihilation. That would be sick to just go tag the world. Tag the world. That would cut my arm off if I got a tat like that. But when nah. I turn 18. He'd be fine with it. Alright, let's play music and see if we actually hear the music. Time to get in the mood for tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. This is some good tunes. Yeah. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. Very funny, Lila. <sighs> Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. What was it before it was Babe's assistant? Oh, sales assistant. All right, that makes sense. Do I have any tats? I do not have a tattoo. I want one, though. Oh, shit. It's a weed pipe. Let's take it. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. My first hangover. Yeah. Dad laughed at me so hard when I came back home. Alright. So, so far, this is way closer to Before the Storm than Life is Strange 1. I'm pretty bored. I'm also looking at everything, though, but I looked at everything in Life is Strange 1, too. And I wasn't this bored. I'm pretty bored. Damn, I still have like 10 books left in the series. Oh, so true. I won't finish until I'm 20. Oh, me neither. Oh, hi Gunther. Sorry, you stay hidden here. Sorry Gunther. Condoms? Oh man, we need some condoms. <sighs> 
Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. We got these for free during sex ed last year. Uh-oh. Sex ed? In America? I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it oh, looks pretty rad. You have a skateboard just like your dad. Cool. Told them not to take a picture of me after the race. <laughs> I look like a sweaty pig. Life Strange One really benefits from having the superpower and uh, the girl getting shot in ten minutes. Yeah, it's it's a, it's actually a pretty good opening. Like no joke, it's pretty good. This is pretty slow. I'll never make varsity at this rate. <laughs> Lila was belting out so hard during that show. She lost her voice for a week. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Also introduces you to a lot of characters right at the start, too, that are going to be there in every episode, pretty much. Dude, most boring page ever. Post a selfie or something. Okay. Don't let Don't them tame you. Sean. Isadora Duncan. All right, she's awful. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want me to pay for it? What? Easy load. Oh, my God. The internet was a mistake. Wow. Just... Wow. Glass Houses Life is Strange too. Alright, let's go. Alright, what am I missing? Hunt for Munchies. Okay, I guess... I, I'm starting to guess I'm not gonna stop out for beer. So I'm gonna have to take some beer. Cookies. Halloween candy. Okay. What do we bring to a party chat? Chips or cookies? Chips for sure, right? We take chips. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. Well, there's not gonna be. Looks right. like I got everything. No, alright. We're pack it all up. We're not stopping. Let's switch it for the beer. Sorry, Dad, I'm still in the beer. You probably won't survive to drink it, though, so let's okay. go. Better take that instead. Yeah, let's take the beer instead. Alright. Alright, I'm out of here. Looks like I got everything. Alright. Better pack it all up. Yeah, let's go. Pack it up, pack it up. Please lay on bed. Which bed? I didn't see a prompt to lay on the bed. Talk to Dan. The door was locked. Finally, ready to go. I can't talk to Time Daniel. To Skype Lila on my laptop. Oh, we're going back. All right. Is it open now? Oh, we can knock. All right. Dude, come on, open up. Why? <laughs> because. I want to talk to you. <sighs> what are you doing in there, Doctor Frankenstein? You gave my choco Chris. To that. So what? He gave it back. Dude, you're so spoiled. What's with the sisters? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Alright, not a fan of the kids' voice acting. Okay then. Okay then. Okay, fine. Don't tell me. All right. After all, I'm only your big brother. His room, his Who rules. after you and takes care of you. Stop it. All I can say is... Watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is gonna be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will how do you, I will be there? How do yes, you know about that? Yes, yes, and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. Did she ask about me? Oh, what, what? Cheating on you, wants to marry you. She wants to marry you. Yes. She wants to marry. Shut up! And I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Ralph stuff. Of course you do. Okay. 
Whoa! Whoa! Daniel's always up to something. I wonder what's next. Did, like, did people not communicate to Don't Noty how much fun it was to rewind stuff? Like, bird hitting a window? That's just, like, there's so many, like, fun moments that come from that power. That are, uh, that just emerge from how things, like, work in the scene. Like, okay, I can't lay on the bed, chat. It won't let me. Lameo got him? Call Lila. Oh, lower boy. Just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. So, uh, Kate, Kate got a, uh... Kate really likes Minnie Mouse. Kate got a, a Minnie Mouse phone for Christmas. So it's like a rotary phone and she can you can dial a fake number and pick it up and it's got like batteries in it and Minnie Mouse will talk to you. So she comes over and she shows it to me and she's so, so I pick up the phone and I and I hit, and I hit the button. Um, who's Kate? Kate is Kate is one of my daughters, and and uh, I'm like and, and and she's like it's Minnie and I'm like hey Minnie, what are you wearing? <laughs> So it's so it's hours later, and I hear her on the phone, and she's in her own little Kate voice. She picks it up and goes, "Hi, Minnie. What you wearing?" <laughs> okay. Hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack. Yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so. We're set for the night. We're set. In case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you going to say to Jen tonight? Finn all, also asked me on Christmas Eve, like all serious, he looks at me and goes, because I was like, so it's, it's Christmas Eve, Santa Claus is, is probably, you know, he's, he's making the rounds already, because in other places it's already far ahead. Uh, it's ahead of time, it's Christmas already in some places, and he looks at me all serious and goes, do you think... Is Santa Claus gonna go to Russia? <laughs> and I'm like, why wouldn't he? And he looks at me and goes, well, you know. <laughs> like, yeah, Finn, Santa Claus is going to Russia. <laughs> well, I don't know. Played cool, talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh my god, you did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. Totally. She's super cool. She's super Duh. cool. Why do you think I'm freaking out? It's Jen She's Amber. so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean, I'm done, look. I made zombie blood. It's um, corn syrup and food coloring. Oh, you had the corn hey. syrup. Okay. Hi, Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. Anyway... Hi, Lila. You're an asshole. So What's it goes. Problem? But... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Post-it note. He's not always cute. You're right, sorry. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. Just tell I'm the truth. Trouble from last time. Work this for me. time, don't get caught. Oh, you have I a lava lamp? Hold on. This I like might lava be lamps. My masterpiece. Well, yeah, it's my portrait. Lame. Oh shit! 
Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. This is a hey, troll. Are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? <laughs> That's a girl thing, no? Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile hell, picture gotta do? What do you mean she's so like well, yeah, what what do you mean she's so into you? Me. Oh yeah, yeah, we just asked her, okay. We will see. Okay. How do you know? Don't comment. <laughs> yeah, lots of love. What? I'm a funny guy. Are you? I better warn her. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey! Uh, Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz! He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage! Pussies! You think you own the block? Question Daniel, confront Brett. Okay, well, Brett's kind of being a prick. However, Daniel indisputably did get the blood all over his shirt. All right, what's going on, Daniel? Let's de-escalate Dude, this. did you get that blood on him? Yeah. Uh, it was... It was an accident. I swear. He's a fucking retard. Whoa. See what happens when you don't listen? Dad told you to stay in the yard. I know, I know, Sean. I was just acting like a zombie and I forgot. I swear. I swear. Where? Don't be Take a dick, bro. Take baby back to his crib. Come on, Daniel. We're done. Yeah, go back to daddy. Pussies. No wonder your mom bailed on you. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. There we Whoa. go. Sean, you Now this is de-escalating. Get inside now. Sean! You're dead meat, bitch. <laughs> 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 Fucking family are going to jail, losers! Oh, he's dead. What's going Fuck on? Me. Daniel, get over here. Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now, calm down, officer. Shut up and step back. What? What's going on here? On the ground. Now. Oh, he thinks it's real. Oh, okay. He thinks it's real blood. It's like this is way worse than what it looks like because he thinks it's blood all over his shirt. Okay. Wait. This guy was he beating again. up my little Find brother. Now, hands behind your Sean. head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Get on the ground, sir. Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. Oh, Sean, Sean, listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. You want to go home? They're good. Uh, is he really gonna shoot the dad? Uh, uh, don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. Said don't move. They didn't Daniel, do anything. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. Oh, this is gonna be a long five days. Fucking hell. Oh man. All right. We're still going to the party though, right? I didn't take ten dollars from the swear jar. Oh, no. oh fuck! No way! No. Daniel, hey, come on.
What do you mean you gotta go? Why'd you have to go? Why'd you have to go? I don't understand. What are you running from? Why? I guess he's just panicking. Alright, that makes sense. I guess he's just panicking. There's no way that they're just going to be like fugitives for the rest of the whole entire story, right? With it being on the news. These two wanted for some unrelated possible explosion fucking gunshot thing. Like... Updated news. Why is it still on it for the fucking blah blah blah? Like, 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 like why, why would they? Like... Like... Okay. Is this the end of episode one? Your decisions, your actions and decisions will have consequences and path the world around you and your brother choose wisely. The cop just shot their dad. Yeah, and there's also a huge explosion, so there's absolutely no way to tell what the fuck just happened there. I guess the fact that they ran away might present itself as being guilt or whatever, but like, how were they even there? Was there a camera seeing anything that wasn't on the dashboard from the police car? I don't, I don't, yeah, whatever, let's see what happens. That was pretty bad. That was really forced and kind of dumb. That was the best cop in Oregon. Oregon's strongest cop just just took uh, the Diaz father down. No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? No Come pouting. On. Dad's dead. No but, pouting. But my feet really hurt. God, get him a new this shirt. And we've been walking for four days. What? It's been two days. Only two. Yeah. Don't even try that shit. Yeah. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Okay, does he know yeah, Dad's so dead? Does mine. I was there too. Oh my God, what Just if Dad isn't knock dead? Knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. Oh God, this is gonna be a long game. So we're gonna have two, we're gonna have two brothers, yeah, and they're on the run, yeah, okay, and and they're gonna be like working together, and they're gonna be solving problems. No, they're gonna be catty and bickering the whole time. Okay, great. All right, cool. This is how people camp in the woods. Yep. It's not like being being at home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? Right. So come on, let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's dad? Uh oh. Daniel. You, you didn't tell him? Come on. We gotta go. I don't think Sean is running for the police. He knows he and Daniel will be separated in the orphanage. <laughs> what? Is that really your read on what just happened? Really? Okay, I really disagree with that. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe. I, I don't think that's it. Why isn't dad with us? <laughs> if it, I hope it is, because that's hilarious. But no, I don't I don't think so. Um, doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes. But I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I'm so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey. At least we don't have to go to school on Monday. Yeah. Right? True. Yeah. Bright side. Yeah. 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 Look. Um, Luke. Everybody's going to be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Especially really? Lila. Yeah, really. I bet Dad would be too. Yeah. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Okay. Feel how how many hours into this does he finally tell his brother his dad's dead and then the kid fucking just like super saiyans out again? How how many hours in? 
And is that going to cause a problem for us? Or is it going to resolve a problem for us? Is it going to be like, shit, we need your powers to get out of here. And the powers are controlled by emotion. Oh, God, time to pull out the Trump card. You know, not that Trump, fuck, not that Trump card. Although it's probably related. Shit. I didn't mean to say that. It was just like, dad's dead. Ah, or is it going to be like, oh, no. (laughs) Awesome. Possum. Awesome possum, I like but that saying. Time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes. Yeah. Yours. Dude, a Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Bigfoot again? Oh. I'm in the wolf squad. Look at my shirt. You can be wolves. Yeah. Look at my shirt. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that that works. Yep. Sorry, it's a hoodie, Just not shirt. Work on that howl. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way. Wolf squad, how are you? Walks. Huh? <laughs> uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no. run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Blah! Uh-oh. Life is strange, too. The mask is off. Episode 1, Roads. Alright, so we have four hours left of this. Alright, I don't think we're getting this done today. on the great potato famine of Ireland is kind of a plot hole to me like why didn't they just grow more like if you're hungry why don't you just plant more food duh okay where is this going what, what is the story here? Just like two bros on the run for five hours? What? What, uh, what? Is there gonna be like. We have to go to mom? Is the mom somewhere? Like, I don't understand. Like, what is. What's good? Is, is there gonna be something? Like, this seems like something that should happen at the end of the episode, not the beginning of the episode. Alright, so you must have a really important, like, like on-the-road plan here, then. Like, where are you going, Big Mac? stretch of road they just keep looping is max in the forest rewinding <laughs> progressively worse nosebleed huh, just like, fuck these two What's people specifically <laughs> trout spring trail oh, all right dude stop you know what you're not allowed to say that ever again yes Wait, sir what You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? Okay. I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. All right. Let's I catch some trout. The first people to stay the night. All right. Time to meet it's some creepy. creepy guy that lives in the There's woods. No, nope, the one across the street. Cars. Oh, We're it's an invisible wall. That's good. I'll look out for you. All right. Do we have a cell phone service here? All right. Good thing we got a blanket and food and drink and a snack. And and a condom. My party plans seems like a lifetime ago. <laughs> He's just holding up the condom like Chloe holding up her fucking thing on her hand, staring wistfully at it. 
my party plans seems like a lifetime ago. Like, who just, what the fuck? Will we ever go back home? Way out of budget, but we need, we've been walking for hours, so Daniel needs this real bad, so did I. Damn. Are you stopped off for a classic burger? Three dollar burger? What? Alright, we have three dollars and thirty cents. Not the most nutritious food, but that's all we've got. So I'm I'm regretting my uh, my chip choice. Should have went with cookies. And also the beer choice. All right, good thing we got our our uh, weed pipe. These assholes really think we killed that cop. F what do you mean? A police officer was found dead next to the body of Esteban Diaz, 45, who was apparently shot by said officer. The only witness, a teenager, was knocked unconscious during the incident and remains in the hospital. The details of the case are not clear, while, while Diaz's two sons, Sean, 16, and Daniel, 9, are now wanted for questioning. Police believe that... They believe what? Right, that, that's a bad place to cut off. Believe what? Believe that they did it? Believe that they might have information? Believe that they're aliens? Believe that there was a gas leak and they might be dead somewhere too? Believe that they might be serial killers? What do you mean? We're, it's really important. I, I can't believe that's where they cut it off. Almost on purpose. How to customize Sean's bag. Some souvenirs can customize your bag. Souvenirs available to customize your bag are shown by an icon. There are two types of souvenirs for customization, patch and, and hung. Oh man. To equip, unequip a souvenir on your bag, select it and press A. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. All right, hold on. All right, so let's, let's, let's do it. A, A, all right, okay. I don't have any. Oh, I do, Arcadia Bay Bundle. Pre-order content. I didn't pre-order shit. What are you talking about? Oh no. Oh no. What does the 24 mean? Does that mean 24 pages in the journal? No, it doesn't. Oh, it means 24 documents. Yeah, we need to see these again. Into the woods. I'm sorry. Uh, hope you have a very good reason to bail on us like that. Coming now, if you want your job, Sean, you just can't bail on us. And I'm in the days for the Sean, boss here. Boss here. Sorry about my previous messages. Carlos here. Gina finally told me about what happened. I am deeply sorry for your loss. We are all thinking of you and hope you will contact the Seattle PD so they can clear this up. He, he wrote this at gunpoint. You and your brother need to be here to get all our help. Please contact me anytime you need anything. Okay, I, I don't understand what is the plan. Jen. This is Jen. Stay anybody still coming by? Not too wasted yet, so come out and play. Sean, I heard something happened to your house. Please call Lila. We're here for you. Sean, I wish I could talk to you, but my parents say that I can't for legal reasons. <laughs> my mom is a little... Oh, okay. That makes it a little better, I guess. And says we can't be involved at all, and you can't contact me again for legal reasons. They didn't, they didn't want me to text you for legal reasons, but there's no way I won't tell you that I'm so sorry about your father. For legal reasons, I can't say why I'm sorry, but I am. I truly wish I could help, but you know, those legal reasons. Your friend... Redacted. Hi, Mr. Diaz. This is Officer Tanaka of the South Seattle PD. We need to talk to you immediately about the incident yesterday involving your father. The best way to deal with the situation is to contact us before it escalates even more. Contact me at this number ASAP, okay? Okay, like text him back and be like, hey, like, what? what is it? I, I don't, I don't, this isn't tracking for me, man. Haven't talked in a while, but I saw a shitload of cops near your house. Let me know if you're cool. Sean, are you cool? Oh, I'm not cool. Where are you, ass? Get over here. Bring beer. We're out already. Now, mother, whatever. Who the hell's Eric? Lila. Hello, you still there? Don't bail me, asshole. Seriously, if you're not going to the party, I'll kill you. Did you hear that noise? It's Halloween, not 4th of July, people. Fuck, I hate that when you get... I fucking... I fuck, I hate that when you ghost out on me. I'm pretty sure you don't do that when you're texting Jen. Am I right? I'm out. Call me when you're ready to go. Police cars right down the street. Call me, please. Dad said your street is on lockdown. Can you see something? 
I hear the police and ambulance sirens. Sean, answer me. Tell me you're okay. I'm worried sick. Your house is on the news. What the fuck, man? Fuck, call me. They say your dad was shot or shot someone. I don't know. It's bullshit, right? Whatever happened, man, just talk to me. Call me anything. I need you to know, right? Sean, I can't fucking sleep. Can't stop thinking about you. I need to know you're okay. I'm not okay, Lila. My dad was shot. And with Daniel, we're out of town. Oh my god, what? 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 Sean, where are you? Can't tell. What do you mean can't tell? You you can't tell where you are, or you can't tell her where you are. Sean, I'm so glad you're okay. I'm not. My dad is dead. He shot him. What? Who shot who? I can't talk. We have to run. No. Just tell her. No. What? You didn't have time on all this walking to text your friend and be like, oh, I need to talk and vent? No. Come over here now. I can help. Will you be safe? No. Call you when I can. Sorry. Just call me when you can. No. To Skype. Skyper. I need to hear you. I know you didn't do anything. We'll tell them. Sean, you there? I can't sleep. We're thinking about you. Please be safe. Both of you. Love you guys. Are you okay? We have to stop for a couple hours. Daniel sleeping. He's done. Where are you now? Hiding. I can get dad to come pick me to pick you up. We can talk this out. No lie. I'm sorry. You're really not coming back, right? No. I'm with you, Sean. Please call me soon. Okay. Like, I feel like there would just be like like essays pouring out of 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 uh of Sean here. Sean. Like I don't I don't get this. But again, dumb kid, hard hard to judge, but you know, this is the third game in a row where I have to say, "Eh, dumb kid." Total nightmare, can't figure out what happened. All blurry. Brett and I got into a fight. Oh, his name was Brett. Then the cop came out of nowhere and then dad was here and he tried to tried to fuck 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 fuck. Lost. Fucked. Only 3.30 left. F need food, clothes, hide out, where? Need to keep drawing so I don't go crazy. Yep. But don't text your friend. Alright. I don't get this. I'm annoyed. But let's keep going. Maybe they'll justify it. Maybe he's dumb. Like, maybe he's dumb. Sometimes main characters are dumb. TD three two one zero zero. Man, it's so dirty. Uh oh. Who came out here and left their car? Hmm. I see something. A what car out that? here. Hope the driver isn't around watching us. This icon means an interaction with Daniel is available. All right, let's check it out. What do you find? If the cops saw his brother do some super hour shit, maybe he's worried they'll take him away. Okay, I don't think any cops saw that, though, did they? Didn't all the cops die? Maybe I'm... Well, he can't know that, can he? I don't know. Maybe. Did he see the super hour shit? Does, does Sean know what happened? Check it out. There's a chunky choco crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love Choco Crisp. There was body cam foot. Nah, he turned the body cam off. He was about to shoot somebody. That was off for sure. This bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get one when we stop next? Please. We, we'll have this one. We're taking it. Let's take this one. Yeah, let's take this one. Let's take this one. Yeah. Nobody's going to miss oh, one. Oh. Choco Crisp bar. Really? I would. This is for a good. <laughs> We're friendly, I swear. No, you're not. I was looking forward to eating that Choco Crisp bar. Now I'm angry and hungry. No. <laughs> Cost. Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have Ooh. dessert. Choco Chris Come effect. On. Let's beat it. Who's gonna remember that there was a chocolate bar on their dad? No, I'd remember actually. I'd remember. Yeah, I'd remember. All right. I hope nobody gets mad we took their choco Chris. Oh, who? No, no, no one's gonna care. It's fine. Don't worry about it. All right, here we go. Discuss. Welcome to Nowhere, Washington. Okay, I have a feeling we're gonna be here for a while. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Okay. Should be fine. Why did this need to be three separate interactions? Why can't it just be one? Now we can see where we are. Yep. Cool. There's a river nearby. Cool. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No. Yes. Duh. It's way too cold for your skinny butt. Okay. God, I'm so bitter after before the storm. I'm sorry. 
<laughs> I'll try and perk up a bit. I'm just so fucking bitter. <laughs> I don't know. I guess they missed that car. Bear but the alert. come after us for the Choco Chris. And they're hunters. You're too little to hunt. We're cool. You gotta get out of this area. There's a bear around. No, no, there's no bear. There is a bear. A Choco Chris bar went missing from a car on the side of the road. It's been reported. I can't let you stay here tonight. Oh, no. Shit, if only we hadn't taken that Choco Chris bar. Dead animal. <sighs> Screw this. Like I needed to see I that. I haven't seen any cars in a long time. We're looking at one right now. Ashford and what? Eep? Elby? Okay. Like anybody's gonna pay in the middle of nowhere. Money doesn't grow on trees. Please support your park. Self-service pay station. Three dollars per vehicle day. To purchase a daily pass. Okay. Well, we, it's not our car. Are, can, are we really? Is it really an option to put the money in? Open. Sean, look. Okay. Open. Damn. This is gonna be a bitch. Okay. I could bust that shit open. Yeah. Let's do it. Rock. I'm committed to the, uh, we're on the run. Uh, Sean? What are you doing? Just taking a little peek inside. But, but are we allowed to? It's a box in the middle of the woods. Nobody cares. Ah, uh, shit. Don't worry. It's empty. Okay, why is it gonna matter then? Time paradox. Who cares? Sign. How? No reception in the shithole. Okay. Someone's gonna think that the money we have on us legitimately is gonna be money from there. Show to Daniel. Daniel! Check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. If only Dad was here. Stop thinking about that. Get over yourself. <sighs> okay, dude. You have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? So you do have to go. It's safer in here. As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh. Well, maybe oh, man. I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. You just clip through the door. Especially after you use it. This Man, toilet is not a septic tank. Do not deposit trash, bottles, tobacco, or diapers. Please respect the park and clean up after use. Alright. Pretty deep, Picasso. I wonder what Dad is doing right now. You plus me plus you my dick. worried about us? Nice. Worried? No, he knows how tough we are. All right, I kind of, I missed the line where he said, like, why we're here. Like, what's the justification uh, and why is the kid buying it? Like, we just have to do emergency go camping or whatever. I, I, I guess maybe they didn't explain it all the way. They're just like, the kid's just going along with it. Maybe he's a bit dazed. Sean, look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? This looks nice. What if they... Eat us. Uh, attack us? Yeah, what if they attack us? It's like Lord of the Rings. Are you Mr. Minecraft? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? 
No, that's I YouTube, you bro. Like... The forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Great vegetables. Oh, that place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Wait, where is he? Daniel understands oh, oh my god, it's Stealth 100. Yeah, he doesn't understand what's going on. Because truth now. Yeah, okay. I just, I always knew exactly where to go. He was a living compass. Man, what are we doing out here? Where are we going? Hmm. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. Yeah, Can let's I not. Taste one, please? No, 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 not. Okay, RB. Uh, hold on. Not, not these ones. Hold on. Hold on. I'm coming. Okay. Check. Ooh, this, that's not checking. That's eating. They're okay. What are you? Go ahead. Okay. All right. Okay. Sure. All right. We're dead. Do 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 Man, if I had a wooden axe, we could build a. I don't know how I still remember these. Oh, this one looks like a Tetris block. Okay, that's the way. Let's Bet not. Can't find me. Okay. Oh yeah. I'll give you ten seconds to find a hiding spot, and then you're toast. Okay, Turn I'm just gonna hit. So I'm just gonna press and LB and find look. you. All right, I'm not looking. One, two. Come on! You're cheating. No peeking. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm coming. Okay. Where are you? Daniel! 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 Sean! 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 Daniel! Now, where could Daniel be? Gotta be up here for sure, right? Gotta be in the picnic area. What the hell's that? Use napkin? <laughs> Knowing Daniel, he shouldn't be hard to find. Uh huh. Man, I thought I was gonna pick up after the first scene. How stupid was I? Right, I guess we can't look at the shit because we have to find Daniel? Great. You can't hide forever! <sighs> Seriously. Where is he? There you are. <laughs> you almost didn't find me. Yeah, we're in a giant forest. The best hiding spot. Maybe this is all a dream and we're going to we're going to wake up in the mill. 
And Chloe's gonna oh, be next well, to Sarah's dead body, maybe. I'll leave that to the zombies. Eat mankind, not animals. Game on, asshole. Charles Emily Chris. Call me now. Oh, let's call. This is stupid. Oh, fuck. Someone's upset. I have no idea where we are. Carvin. I some more. People write some stupid shit sometimes. Fuck you, perfect penis. Cockboy. Hold on. Hold on. I need to do the taste on. test. Hold I'm on. Coming. Hold on. I gotta check. Here I go. I'm checking. Right in the berry hole. <laughs> no, these are these are bad. Hey man, do not eat those. Seriously. They taste awful. Don't eat them. Okay, okay. Picnic and hiking site. Well. I bet nobody comes out here to picnic anymore. Someone must be. Well, that's good for us. No camping? Uh-oh. Don't worry. Nobody's gonna find us out here. Do not feed or disturb the animals? What? What kind of animals? Like bears? Or coyotes? Or... Wouldn't the best play be to right now to sleep under the picnic tables? Unless they think they can find like a cabin somewhere nearby? More like squirrels and rabbits. Anything with claws and fangs. Oh yeah. Bears, coyotes, uh, wolves, oh. Bigfoot. Anything with claws and fangs, really. Jeez. We shouldn't be out here. <sighs> I'm kidding, Daniel. There's nothing in this forest. Don't freak yourself out. Maybe you can move the picnic table, stack them together. There absolutely is something in this forest. Let's just hope that doesn't happen while we're here. All right. No fucking I hope fun. Nobody gets mad. Now we know what not to do, right? I guess. No drugs. No like trash. No hunting. No fireworks. No firearms. No graffiti. No excessive noise. No chocolate. No fun. Please play, please just play Neon White. No, we're playing Life is Strange 2. This won a BAFTA. BAFTA nominated, BAFTA award winning game. No fucking way, it did, it won a BAFTA. Whoa, Sean, did you see that? Oh, there was, we could have hit yeah, a button there. Yeah, it's a kitty. Aw, that raccoon must be starving. Raccoons are way smarter than us. He'll find more food. You know hey, what? You're right. I think this. What if this raccoon is related to the to the one on the road? Hey, don't think about stuff like that. Maybe they were brothers, like us. It makes oh, me man. sad. Do you think every Stop. time that raccoon sees a car, he thinks it was dead brother? Just raccoons. All right, step over. All right, this seems like the way. <gasps> Let's go the other way and see what's there. That's one big tree. We've been walking for so long. I wonder how far we are from Seattle. <sighs> Shit. Okay, is it blocked? Landslide. I do not want to get stuck out here. We've got to find a campsite. Okay, you're not in a car. This is easily traversable. All right, whatever. Ho oh, ho ho. Looks like a charged creeper was here. What? How could a vine do that? Uh, Minecraft. Daniel will have a shit fit if I go too far. D-A-E play Minecraft? <laughs> Daniel, you're too far off. Wait! Do I really have to babysit the kid? He doesn't just snap over? Do you need help? 
Okay, come over. What are you doing? Let's go. What's your issue? All right. All right, let's go. Okay. Still there. All right. Hey, Dan, come over here. Daniel, you hear that? Uh oh. <laughs> what the? What are you clipping through it? Come through. You can do it. Come here. Just go. Go. Let's you just run through. Yeah, you're here. You you've done it. Okay. Berries. Eat. Let's check. Yeah, these are fine. None for Daniel. All for Sean. Show to Daniel. Hey. Dude. I found some berries. Come get some. Do 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 Daniel, you're too far off. What the hell is that? Oh man, this is just like The Last of Us. I should have listened in biology class. Love Joe completely just forgetting about Daniel, aka the Golden Gate. What do you mean forgetting about him? I've tried to get him fucking back up so many times. What are you talking- Uh, Sean, where are you? From what? Oh, you got over the trunk. Okay, one second. Come in. No way they're putting us in foster care. All right, chatter. When you're right, you're right. Come on. I got you. <laughs> There's no fucking way. Thanks. Like a clicker. Yep. Yep. Creepy. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it. He and Daniel, man. That chatter's name, Shimano Einstein. Oh, this looks nice. Oh, okay, never mind. Can't see it. Ooh. Time to meet the guy we stole the chocolate looks bar like from. A cave. Kind, kind of spooky. No, actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? I would For prefer us, man. the picnic table. 
we're gonna stay in there? I don't know. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Mm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. Okay, go set some cool. traps. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. Right. Yes. Yeah, let's do it. I'm uh, I'm in. So what do we need? Shit to make a fire. Uh You know, shit to make a fire. Yep. Um Sticks. twigs, branches. Are you sure we can do this? Tinder. Who can stop us? Nobody. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Time to crack open a brisky. Was the fire pit always there? When Daniel comes over and says, why are you drinking a beer? I'm going to tell him it's game day. That is one sturdy ass blanket. So tired. I read this already. Sean, check it out. I already got one branch for the fire. <laughs> Coming. Why did you do that? Hey, Sean, let's have a race. Whoever finds three logs is the winner. Cool? Okay. Thought your feet hurt. You're brave to challenge me. So let's do it. All right, found no one. way you're going to beat me. New clipper clipping his tinder yet? No, the, the rubbing his hand. Why do you rub his hand in the dirt? I don't know why he did that. I wish Noah was out here with me. We could build a fort. Now this is perfect. Draw your for five purposes. There's no way it's gonna be like this the whole time. Oh, we have to find the three and then bring them back. Okay. Think you can take yes, me? Two. Uh oh. Okay, lazy. Go find some wood. Ooh, Daniel was in it winning. That's what I said when I downloaded the game. Yes, here's number two. Nice and dry. Is it nice and dry? Wait, is that someone's f hmm. fishing? That's enough for a toasty fire. Three. Why is there a bra here? Let's draw it. If I let him beat me, he'll be happy. Let him? He kicked our ass. What do you mean? All it's right. Rachel Amber's bra reference to the first right. game. I, I don't yeah. know if you're kidding. Okay. That should be enough for Incredible. <laughs> See? Told you. I won. <sighs> All right. We have a little time to explore before we light up the fire. Cool. I'll go check the river. Don't touch the bra. We might get cooties. Man, this place is like their own giant camp. We should catch some fish for dinner. Okay. Are we starting the fire? Ignite? Alright. Carving. 1986? Damn, that's ancient. For our beloved friend, Linda King. Are you having fun yet? I am unbelievably bored. 
Shit, those are bear claws. This is a very bad opening. Mm, not I'm, tell I'm worried about the stream. <laughs> I have concerns. I hope I get a good night's sleep tonight so I can riff up some some banter tomorrow. Cause it's like, goddamn. I ran into a web like that when I was a kid. And I died. Worse than before the storm? Nah, I don't think it's worse than before the storm. So far, but we'll see. All right, can we talk about the bra now? No, we don't care. All right. We can yell as much as we want. Oh, release it. Hey, what are you doing, Sean? Skipping stones. Can I try? You never skip stones. <sighs> yeah. But it was a long time ago with Dad. Who? <laughs> okay. Then show me. Watch me. Nice. Dude, come on. That's a boulder, not a rock. Here, you need a flat rock. Hold it like this. Look at my hand. Boom. Okay, I did it. My turn. Hold it with your thumb and finger. And spin your wrist when you throw. Almost. What'd I do wrong? Try again. Not bad. Give it another try. They're too Not big. Get him some smaller close. stones. Try again. Try again. You've almost got it. Oh, man. Try again. I'm getting into the zone. Don't give up now. He's got it. Jesus I Christ, it's Jason Bourne. It. Did you see yeah, that's gonna oh, matter. Yeah. That was awesome. I think you're ready for the Olympic stone skipping team. We can't go our separate ways. We've bonded so well. That's true. You did pick the really let, try again happen. option four times and I learned how to skip a stone with you. That's a memory I'll cherish forever. All right, so you're gonna come with me now? No, I need Polaroid. Uh-oh. Hope they had a better time than us. Okay. Would this, would this just be here? I don't think I want to see the spider who made it. Wasn't the spider on the web? Explain. <laughs> You're safe, little bro. Spiders hibernate in the fall. Good. I remember when you pushed me into that web. Do they? Hey, that was a long time ago. You got me back, right? Yeah, well, you screamed when you saw that plastic spider. <laughs> so funny. Yeah, ha ha. <laughs> At least they won't bug us tonight. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> no. Spiders aren't bugs. I'm digging the spot. What are you digging? Not today. Oh. Good thing it's grammatically incorrect. Oh no. The penis. Check this out, Sean. Whoa. Nice view. You can see so far. I'm coming. Let's go eat. I'm coming. Wait, I'm coming. <laughs> You're really going to make me walk around game? Really? Okay. At least no one's going to look for us out here.
When's the evil trucker gonna show up that we just stole his chocolate bar? Who, after that cop scene, is probably gonna be like, Hey, I'm Jim, I hate Mexicans... Uh... Uh... Rocky. You look like a couple Mexicans. I hate you, I hate Mexicans. Oh man, I think this guy hates Mexicans. Let's run away, like... Let's... Ugh, okay. Something happened, it's please! Beautiful. Pretty amazing, huh? Mm -hmm. See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Trucker X. <laughs> hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? I don't know. Cotton candy? Oh, That's man. it? Frank would love Cotton this. Candy? I don't know. What do you see? A dragon. Our babysitter. A dragon. A dragon. What? Where? Oh my god, they okay. can see me. There's the tail. And the horns. And the fangs. And the smoke coming out of its mouth. That's oh, the cloud. I see it. It's awesome. Are we gonna play as Daniel now? Wouldn't it be cool if we had a pet dragon? Ooh, I see something else. There's a giant douchebag. <laughs> oh yeah? Where? <laughs> Right here. <laughs> right here, huh? <laughs> oh, I thought it was gonna be me again. That's Fimble winner for you. <sighs> Come on, let's go eat something. I wish people would stop making fun of this game. It was really important during my teenage years. <laughs> it cured my insomnia. <laughs> Amazing comment. All right, and I know. Plus two, chat. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? Plus two equals keck. Blow. I have bigger lungs. Sure, blow. You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes. Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. I think we're going to be reading reviews of this game after we're done. Do 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 do. This could have been Yeek. Instead of yikes, it could have been yeek. Wish we had more. If only I had got the cookies. I know. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mmm. Do you want a piece? Maybe one piece. I'm good. Uh -huh. I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now, not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. <laughs> Figures you try to get revenge, judge. 
Hey, Damn. I want a new continuity. Trial. Too late. Court closed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when we took the when we took the chocolate bar out of the car earlier, the consequences that we get this scene and it makes the game longer. Oh man, that was a really bad consequence. I wish we had passed. Mmm, so good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Yep. Yesterday was yesterday. That shake was so good, so good. Oh, dude, that shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. <laughs> I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. One day. Promise. Fire pit. Man, I made a fire tonight. Dad would be proud. I mean, you used the lighter, so not really. Beer. Nice, Sean. Beers are exactly what we needed for survival. Man, eh, it's calories. This is the coolest secret base ever. Nobody's gonna find us. Wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. I can't sleep. Oh, just play this game. All right. Let's call Jen. All right, are we actually gonna call Jen at some point? Mm. Episode four, my God, I need to call someone, but I don't have anyone's number. I know. Who writes people's numbers down? Look, I full moon. Oh. <laughs> Almost. It's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Yeah. We are the wolves. Dude, we are the wolves. See? Ow, ow! Ow, 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 And then one came back. Funny how a little food chills Daniel out. Still no reception. Of course. Um. Okay. I'm bored. Sean, can I play Mustard Party on your phone? No. Nope. Please. No. Nope. Uh, yeah, sure. No reception. So go for it. Battery's yeah. gonna run out like tonight Thanks. anyway. Might as well use it. Oh, I'm so gonna beat your score. Yeah. Oh, come on. Almost. Almost. What? No! I was so gonna beat your score. You wish. Stupid phone. Stupid phone? Hey, you doing okay? You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Okay, so I don't think I don't think Sean knows about the powers then. He must have not seen because he would have brought it up by now. Was that it? Sean? Okay, yeah, that's me. Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? A little bit, yeah. I don't remember everything. Yeah. Not your fault. Nothing happened. We got in a fight. Not your fault. It's, it's a little his fault. We got in a fight. We got in a fight. Did you kick his ass? Yeah. But nobody won. It's not like the movies, Daniel. Get some sleep. Oh, a zombie. Oh god, I wish uh, I could. You look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. There's some chips left in the bag. Finish the chips. I think we earned some serious rest. The hell? I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. 
You did awesome today, Daniel. Oh. Really? Hell yeah. Isn't it crazy how fun that couple killed anyone? No, he he lives. Real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. He just ha started having a seizure Why for some reason. Stay open, son. Sleep tight, bro. Man, we we're just slowly bleeding viewers away. The longer this goes on. <laughs> Every time I look at the viewer count, it's like 10, 20 less than it was before. <laughs> and I don't blame you. Like, god damn, this is so boring. Alright, it's gonna. It's, this is gonna be a good scene. Here we go. It's gonna be interesting. Oh no, I have powers. Time to fucking set the place on fire. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sean? I'm scared. I keep hearing noises. Uh, no. No, don't be. Uh, everything's cool. But we're Is this alone. a dream? You said there were bears and there were wolves. Uh-oh. They're... Sleep. They're sleeping. Yeah. Like like we should be. And look, our our fire's still roaring. <laughs> Daniel, we'll find a better place tomorrow, okay? And food too. I promise. Did we wake up just for this? Nothing's gonna happen? I swear to God, if we just go back to sleep in this morning. I swear to God. Really? Wow. We're wolves. What the hell was that noise? Man, I'm starting to think maybe this game is going to be shit. Because here's the trajectory I'm seeing of, of like of how this went, alright? It seems like th like they were banking on... Oh, Alright, people really like Life is Strange 1, right? Yeah, that's true. People really did like Life is Strange 1. Okay, so what we're going to do is, is that we're going to have a mystery in Life is Strange 2. Of people are going to be coming into it being like, Damn, ready for a really good Life is Strange experience. I really like the first one. And the mystery of the first, after the first episode is like, Okay, that was kind of slow. I wonder when it gets good. And then the twist ending is it doesn't. And then that just pissed people off so much that they were like, fuck it, I'm done with Life is Strange. And that's how you get the the like the like stacked reviews on Steam of like, so many people played the first one and reviewed it. So many people played Before the Storm. Life is Strange 2? Eh, true Colors. Like, fucking like 1% of the people that played Life is Strange 1. Because it's like, ah, fuck it, I'm done with it now. What the fuck is gonna happen here? It's easier now. We're okay, now down. we're walking. We just gotta keep walking. Alright. Yeah. What about the you chocolate said bar? Were getting better yesterday. Yeah. And the day before. Okay. I'm sorry, dude. Dude. I'm trying my best. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. They walk, 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 Mom. walk. Are you okay? Yeah. No. Talking to me or the bird? I was just thinking about when Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Who? Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like his, so he said he was going to get us after school. What did you do? 
We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. <sighs> I'm sorry, Nano. I should have listened. You never believe me. Like with Brett? Yeah. Hey, there's something ahead. What the hell? Yep. You, you did? Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. You did get fake blood all over him, though. Oh my god, it's Trucker X. Finally. I thought we'd never get out of these woods alive. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map. Yeah, you're right, Mary. So we can find Where, the best route. Where's the shadow? All right. Hey, come on. Really? I know last night was tough, but tonight will be better. I swear. S supernatural yeah. kids don't uh, don't hope. cast a shadow. Utah, <laughs> you're a long way from home, dude. How can someone drive with this mess? It's, it's not so bad. Like, it's messy, I agree, but it's not so bad. Oh, just sitting outside having a family I meal. Check my goddamn voicemail here. Wish we can sleep here There's tonight. nothing to do here. And a real bed. California plates. Maybe they can help us. Nah. Too much traffic. Why would the why would the California plates help us more than the Coco. Utah plates? Honey, Send Daniel to bag. Hey, how's it going? Um. Hey. Hi. Uh oh, here it comes. Oh hi there. Spare the food. Nice weather. Happy Halloween. Hey, happy Halloween. My brother's a zombie. Don't you have a costume? Nuh-uh. I'm eleven years old. Halloween is for kids. Oh, my brother loves it. I don't. I'm almost 12. Whoa. Kids Damn. always want to She's going to be 13 by the end of this, this conversation. Only. So, how old are you? Uh, he's nine. I'm almost 10. Oh, you can talk. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he can talk. A lot. Whatever. All right, bye. Oh, uh, well, we got to get going. You look busy, so have fun. Bye. Take care. Daddy, I'm cold. Sean, Sean, you sure it's okay to poke around? Okay. Be gentle. Fly. Oh, be free. What? Not bad, Sean. We, I didn't. I didn't know that was there. What? I'm not even sure what kind of bird you are. But I'll keep this. Half carved bear. Do they make actual money doing this? Probably. I want one. Can't believe how lost we are. Let's fix up this car. All we need is a car battery. Why do they let this rust out here? Some sparks, spark plugs? I know Dad would be able to fix it. Nah, Chloe could yeah. though. Maybe not that one, dude. He has to finish your car first. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Looks like the perfect setting for the Washington Chainsaw Massacre. Washington. Oh, another, another car. The gas station is closed. So are we. Jeez. Chill out, folks. Nobody wants to go to your weird house. What kind of name is Stamper, anyway? Huh. I wonder when we're gonna go see Stamper. 
It sucks I can't do Halloween at home. It's dad. Hmm. We're not too far away. Are we gonna do another camping thing at Tacoma, to to Tacoma Rock? Our airport. The hell's that noise? It's going to be freezing tonight. It's called Jen. So we need to stock up. Oh, let's get some bears. <laughs> kind of creepy, huh? Nah, I think they're cute. We should have one at home. Dad would love it. No way we're carrying a freaking log around, dude. <sighs> okay. Right. Nachos and cerveza? You sound like an expert douchebag. Hey, look. Okay. They're gonna teach us Spanish. Este tipo es un idiota. I'm fine. I'm too young. Case of cougar attack. Throw a 20-year-old male. <laughs> Sean? You see that sign? Warning? Well, these guys can right. speak can English, speak. Spanish, and Mexican? They're but very talented. Mastered. I can what barely speak I? English. Nah. You were totally brave. Um. Maybe some other time. I'm on it, Hillbilly. Oh, the Chainsaw Massacre. Yeah. After the night we just had, I'll pass. All right, we gonna see the whole article now. Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. <laughs> we can't go back. Oh god, damn it! Can't let Daniel know. Not right now. Don't worry, Daniel. Soon this will all be over, and you can go back to being a normal kid again. Thanks, Sean. Let's sit and it's think. Cool we found this place. Dad always had a thing for gas stations. Ground control to we Major so Tom. He says they're all kind Ground of control to me. Feel familiar. Okay. Almost like home. Same bad coffee. Same nasty toilets, same food. But I don't feel at home at all. Sean, I'm hungry. Can we go eat something, please? Um, yeah. Sorry, just daydreaming. Okay. Let's go. So at this point in the Life is Strange 1 playthrough, we were walking through a dorm and we were talking to all the different characters that were going to be involved in the story from then on. Not all of them were that important, but they were, especially in, in, in episode 2 with, with uh, the thing that happened with Kate, they were involved. And okay. they never really ran away. Let's get supplies. Are we ever going to see this family again? Are they going to be at every gas here. station? Send Daniel to bed. I'm not doing that. I'm too proud. Like, uh, just... Fucking hell. There might be some leftovers in it. Uh oh. No, we can buy food. Oh, We're fine. Is this our life now? Wonder how important the money management is going to be. Wait, you didn't grab any money before you left? You didn't grab any more supplies before you left? You had time. Hello there. Whoa. Couple minutes. Hey. hey. Choco crisp. Nice. Two dollars for a choco crisp? Mm. And that burger was three dollars? Sorry, dude. You'd had to drag my ass to make me come back here after all this. Hell yeah, fishing. Oh man, you're doing so good, honey. Yeah, we got one. Kate Milton really likes watching us fish. 
Build up a fire, set up an eco-friendly site. No tourist is gonna do this shit. Tour guides. Tea break with the elders. Oh, they have souvenirs. I need them for my bag. Wish we could join the crew, guys. Truckers. All right, I, trucker. This is gonna. Oh, what the fuck? Scarily refreshing. All right, we're gonna get wolves for this. For, later on, truckers gonna be like, "You're not a real trucker." Be like, "I do. I have a sticker. Look, <laughs> trucker sticker." Might on Papa Road cred. Boom. Oh, it's a souvenir. Never mind. This is a very well put together store. Out of order. Never mind. I hope Halloween isn't ruined for Daniel by all this. Add to basket. Four fifty for a bottle of water? American? Hey. I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Uh no, I don't mean I mean it's not as weird as it seems though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? What? Dude, we just met. Nobody. Nobody? Yeah, Sir, this I is agree. a gas station. Yes. Why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. Of course I'm it is. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. All right, we're going to see you in every episode. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, no! writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I <gasps> know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Yeah, how'd you know that? Yeah. Yeah, we're on the road, going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, it sounds, but it sounds like I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. Every single episode, we're going to find him looking at something weird on his, like his laptop. One. And every single time, he's going to have a really good explanation for it. Until in episode 5, he's going to be looking at porn. And we'll be like, well, what's your explanation this time? And he's going to struggle and be like, nah, this time it's just porn. I was just looking at some porn. And be like, oh, okay, cool. Thank you. Lila would love that. Yeah, she would. Yeah. Not your girlfriend, by the way. Make two hot dogs. Six dollars. Mm, hot dogs. All right, hot dog would yes, be pretty yes, good. Hi, what are you looking at? Oh, <laughs> hey there, right. I like it. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh, but not for you. Why? I'm like too nervous stuff? to drink any coffee. Yuck. It's uh, mm. not. Drink the, the dog coffee stuff. If you like coffee. I'm nine years old. I know these kind of things. Mac and <laughs> cheese. Yeah, I'm sure you do. What's Maybe not name? as good as dad's. Yeah. Hey, but yummy. I'm Brody. Tent? I'm how could I possibly have $70 at this point? Or is it just work. for stealing? Ooh. Ooh, getting a sleeping bag is probably hey, really nice worth job. it. Kinda, Camping yeah. dishes. Shit. Well, we could just camp out in here. Alright, we're definitely not getting a t-shirt. Oh, man. Daniel would love that thing. I, be a I know Daniel would love to have a souvenir. Okay, getting him a change of clothes is not a bad idea, but that's way too okay. expensive. See you later, Knife Mr. display. Pretty sweet. Maybe Dad will give it to me for Christmas. Alright, I'm thinking of getting the sleeping bag and the hot dog. However, it's not going to kill me if I don't get the sleeping bag, so maybe that's a waste of money. Right? I'm Daniel. So what exactly are you doing all the way out here? It's a secret adventure. Is that so? Sounds intriguing. Did you make all these bears? Oh no. I won't take any credit for the bears. That's all on my husband. <laughs> he won't well, stop making them. Oh, no matter them. how much. Perfect. We should I be able to find so our way cute. with this. Well, good for you. Sure glad somebody does. Those cost two dollars. You just stole. Um, Beware the what's that? Witch. Dad would have loved this so much. 
Don't worry, What's we'll your get name, you huh? a new family so soon. Oh, ATM, here we go. Right. I'll just bust out my platinum card. ATM Chan. Let's Oh yes! Alright, here we go. Amen. Check this out. Yes. This is worth a dollar. Power bear claw. Let's go. Uh, can we play? I bet it's easy to get a prize. Yeah, so yeah, easy. No. See all those prizes still inside? Nobody wins. Except the machine. Oh. But hey, we're the Wolf Brothers. Us teach this machine a lesson, right? Yes. So, who goes first? You. Go get him, little brother. No one can defeat. Ooh, Just... I'm gonna beat this boss. Let's go, Power Bear Claw. Do, 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 Wait till you get a good opening. Not there. It sucks. Don't right. grab so fast. Yeah. All right. This is hard. Uh, can you try? You can do it. No, Come you can on, do it. Daniel. You can do it. You can do it. It's like the really? pebbles all over again. Yeah, you can okay. do it. Yep. Here I come. You can do bear. it. Go for it. We don't need a sleeping bag. No. <clears throat> God damn it. Oh bullshit. All right. Oops. Sorry. It's okay. <clears throat> I hate this game. All right, don't give don't up. Don't give up, man. It's like yeah, it's like stones. the Skippy Stones. Remember? Yeah, yeah. I remember. I got and, this. And because I remember, yeah, you're right. I did get the Skipping Stones eventually, which means I can get this thanks to the Skipping Stone determination. Thank you, Sean. Almost. <gasps> almost. Almost. Yeah. yeah. Bet you're the first one to get a prize out of here. Ooh, let's see, let's see. Oh my god, there's fifty dollars in here. So cool. Look, Sean. I beat the machine. Told you nobody beats a DS. Except the twitchy cop, apparently. Power Bear. Exclusive power action figures. Play here and win. Alright. Power Bear in the backwoods. More like power marketing. Okay, I want to play. My turn. Wish I could send Lila a postcard. Like a regular holiday trip. We need to stock Let's up on see. beer. Okay, how, that's like like what? A day's worth of water and it's 450? Sliced bread. All right, again, that's just uh food. How many calories is sliced bread? There's that's gotta be stuff here for us. That's a lot of calories for six dollars compared to two hot dogs, right? How much? How much is the hot dogs? The bread's gotta be way more calories than a hot dog. That that that's for sure. All right, is the game smart enough about this shit though? All right, we're gonna get the sleeping bag. It's expensive, but I can't let Daniel freeze. All right, how much more money do we have? All right, we have enough for hmm. bread. Who sends postcards? Boring letters. Alright, bread. You can't make a fancy sandwich. The bread will be just fine. But we can just eat fucking bread. Alright, water? Because we can't drink water out in the wild. Because we're gonna. What do you mean it's better than tap water? Wait, is tap water available? Because if so, just put it. Okay, do not click on that. Alright, what's our total? We took a pine cone. I wanted to leave this pine, but Dan insisted. Tree leaves. Mastered the scan machine. Can't get all that volume. Don't Dude. look at me like that. I know. Oh no, now he's gonna want one. Bear, Daniel? Uh oh. Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. And he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh, now I feel bad about stealing a hot dog. All right, I don't know if we can afford a hot dog. Can we afford it? What What was it again? It was 16, add 6, add 450? No, we can't afford the hot dog. Or Did it already take the money away from this? 
I don't think we can afford the hot dog. Alright, this is it. Go, We're done. Pay. Speak. Hey. Can I get a discount? Hey. Hi. Good evening. Yes. Can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. We're camping. We're on a... We live out here. We're camping. We're on a road trip. Oh. We're on a... A road trip. So where are your parents? With our dad. No parents allowed. With our friends. We're with our dad. We're with... Our dad. Hmm. That makes sense. Yeah. How come he's not here with you? He's waiting outside. Waiting in the car. Went hiking. He went... He went... Hiking? Waiting in the car. I didn't see a car pull up. Went, went hiking. He... Went hiking. So he told us we could hang out and explore. Okay. He's leaving you out here during a road trip? Yeah, it's weird. I know. Doesn't he care about you? No, he yeah, doesn't. Yeah, no. Don't worry. It's super fine. Yeah. If you say so. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. Pay. Ouch. Okay. We got that. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Seriously, who's buying all these wooden bears? Oh, we do have a sale on our famous bears. Buy one. Yeah, it's a dog. Oh, a puppy! Sure. Super cute doggy. Wanna buy the puppy? $30. Is this yours? No. no. Just another stray mutt. Oh, God. Aww. He must be sad. We're not, we're not taking What's the dog. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? Let me think. Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. It would be pretty adults cool. adults to take care of her. Not kids. Whoa. What's your problem, lady? Good. I'd love to. She's right. We can't take care of the dog right now. You paid, now get out. Where's the infinite money cheat code? Six Hope you don't mind me hogging the table. Perfect. I do actually. You put your, your coat on the other chair? It's weird how I'm relieved to see all this stuff. What a monster. Alright, let's steal some soda. Alright, I'm not stealing anything. Let's leave. Alright, they must have left some food, right? Let's go see. Hey, look! Empty table! Oh, let's grab it and check out this map. Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about ice. Not while these people are here. Don't want to freak them out. D there are no people here, Jelly. Just go for it. Not while these people are here. Don't want to freak them out. Enter together. Hey! Come on in. Let's wash a little. Ugh, I'm coming. Clean up, fill a bottle. Oh, for fuck's sake. For fuck's sake, I, I spent money on the bottle of water for no reason. He looks, he looks like one of your drawings. Fill up the condoms with water too. We need them. Nice. Free water for us.
No, well, we have two bottles now. It's not the worst thing in the world. Ah, cool. I know. It's a wash fast. Ugh. My hands are ice. Turn on the water eater. Okay. You're done. Looking good, Sean. Oh, shit. My face. Look older. You look older, dude. Yep. Are we good to go, or do you need to... Ma, it's okay. I went in the woods just before we got here. Cool. You don't flush. We call it cops. <laughs> Stop watching me, perv. Stop watching me, perv. All right. Is nothing really going to happen in this scene, too? All right, they're gone now, right? We can we can go through the trash. Not while these people are here. Man, that popcorn is getting Don't staler and staler. Oh, that's Brody's car. Eat and study map. It's our table now. All right, here we go. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? Huh. Is that all we've got? Sorry, you know. Better than nothing. Right? Why do this to yourself? Sometimes you have to play bad games, all right? Sometimes you have to. Yeah. Uh-oh, it's Trucker X. Pick up Trucker X. Hey, Brody. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Sounds so familiar. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah. For Hope you. you read it. to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. All right, so we're here. All right. This is it. Are you sure? <sighs> yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Oh, but it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. All right. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just. I hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh. Sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. No, fuck off. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Discuss. Discuss. Flee. Attack. Alright, let's discuss. We really did pay for it uh, all. Excuse us, sir. We were just hiking. I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, don't touch my brother! What the hell is this guy's problem? Hi. 
off super well. Tank. Hey, that's how my that's how my story ends. Listen, I caught myself a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. Should have hit him. Oh shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. So is is money just never gonna matter again after this now? That's it? It'll be off our property and won't be our problem anymore. If you say so then. Good thing we played the claw machine. I'll let you deal with it. No. Oh. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. You saw it in the paper. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. No. You, I'm American. <clears throat> Watch it, punk. No. Whatever. Going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? He is dressed in a hoodie though, chat. Can you really blame him? He is dressed in a hoodie. Wish I knew. That shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out in the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. oh, for fuck's sake. Won a BAFTA, by the way. Yep. Oh, fucking hell. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Yep. Shit. Bastard turned the lights off. Fuck. Come on. It's only plastic. Yeah, I knew you were a criminal. I caught you breaking and exiting. This shit! Why is it wrong to reference real life? What am I missing here? Okay, I kind of feel like this is an earnest. Do you, do you really think that this He's is... Okay. He's okay. Just get out of here. Really? Do you really think oh, this is being fuck. genuine right yeah. now? Like... This is so ham fisted, forced on the nose. Well, like, really? Like, <sighs> okay, what am I supposed to be doing? Daniel. Daniel, Daniel must be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. If I keep moving back and right, left and right, it'll break, right? I'm just like kind of, I'm weakening it, right? Wonder if I could get more light from it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Fuck. Yes. 
Excellent. Yes, we have light. Okay. Now we can push the sign because we have light? What? Yeah, we get it. You're the perfect Americans. Sean! Yeah, one of those bears! Daniel? I'm right here! Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. But I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. That's the guy pretending to be hey, your brother. Daniel, Don't fall for it. Great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you. We have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. This isn't the real racism. Racism people that people face. People are denied homes, jobs, opportunities, and healthcare. I think this is the only way racist act is done. See, I don't really want to talk about this because I don't really have much experience with it. But, but my my gut is telling me, and I'm sorry if my gut is wrong. I really am. But. I just want to say it and then I get it off my chest and if I'm wrong then I will 100% accept being wrong. But this kind of shit that's happening in the game just makes people on the left look fucking deranged when they're not. Because it just makes it like, it's so, so exaggerated and just so forced that it, it like justifies people criticizing people on the left when they say this shit shouldn't happen. You know what I mean? Like, like, it just... It hurts the cause that you're trying to support. You know what I mean? Like, am I off? That's how I feel. And I don't know if that's right or not, but that's how I feel right now. Just like, oh, God, really? Like, he called the cops on us. Thank ask you. to tear off. Wait, we dropped There's something, didn't we? we? Let's use the bear. Okay, 1982, 822, 1982. <laughs> All right, read. Let's read the paper. I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines as Dad. Oh yeah, this racist shithead is a real pillar of the community. All right. There's nothing worse than a, a bad argument for a position that I agree with. Yeah, that's why I kind of hate Twitter. Well, one of the reasons why I hate Twitter, uh, like seeing people that you generally agree with and even uh, like support their stance, just make horrible arguments but also act like complete assholes just it's like oh god damn man like it hurts that i can't be m like fully on your side you know it's like god like shit like let's just be better you know learned it from god of war on behalf of our commerce bureau we're proud to present to you our models model citizen and businessman award for 2014 uh, your long years of service and charity to the community are well known to all. Everybody who passes through your station has received the same great smile and service over 10 years and many more to come. The awards ceremony will be held at the town hall on June 10th, 22, 2 p.m. More details to come think, as, the event is, uh, as the event is finalized. Again, a personal thank you for being the face of our commu Commerce Bureau. Warmest regards, Ernest Schack. Can you try and open this vent? Does it get okay? Now, now I'm pushing a little bit, and I feel a little, I feel a little unstable ground now. But does this kind of thing, like I'm not saying this specifically, it could also be in like different media as well. But does it give kind of people like plausible deniability to have like dangerous and 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 kind of racist thoughts? It's like I can't be racist. I've never gone up to two Mexican kids in in a, in a gas station, accused them of stealing, hit them over the head, kidnapped them, tied them to a fucking pole in my gas station, and then kicked them in the head and told them we need to build the wall. So literally, I can't be racist. I've never done that. And and that's what racist is in media. You know what I mean? Like it's, I, I don't, I don't know. This just feels so bad to me. Okay, he's getting it out. Okay, good. Don't worry. We'll figure something out. Maybe it gets better. Anyway, I'm done. I'm already on, on, uh, I feel uncomfortable already. I'm done. Ask to open. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. It won't open. It's locked. What do I 
do? I don't know. Let me think. There's a window over there. Are you going to this game did not win a BAFTA? A was for a of I thought it won a BAFTA. Did it only get nominated for one? I thought it said ba BAFTA winning on, on the page. Oh, an actor won one. Okay. It is. But be careful. Oh, more light. Now I can light move the couch. Him. Thank you. I can see better now. Of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Sean? What's going on? I'm trying to get the hell out of here. I almost got it, bro. Now we can break the anchor. Just hold on. Right. I need something to break this shit. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. File in the workshop. Something sturdy? File in the workshop? I think I saw a big file thing in the workshop with all those bear sculptures i know you can find oh yeah, yeah i remember seeing that yeah okay. i'll try come on sean we gotta hurry I kind of explain the chat to turn into a back and forth discussion about racism in media and politics. I hope it's fine for chat and Joe. Don't mind him. Well, the the game is is going there, so the people want to discuss it. It makes sense. It's here. Is this what you wanted? This is it. You rule, Daniel. I'm just mad because it clearly showed with Kate Marsh shrugging stuff that they can somewhat write respectable and believable stories around controversial topics, but they just shot the bed the first time they got, like with, with this one. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Someone in chat said that these kind of people do exist, so I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it is, it is uh, fine. It just seems really forced to me. Like, the stuff with Kate didn't really set off any alarm bells to me, but this is. But, like, like obviously, like, I haven't experienced much racism in my life, so... Uh, yeah, and I don't live in America, so eh, I don't know. It just doesn't feel right to me. Sorry, and I just wanted to say that. Come on, let's do this. Wait, did that just? Did he just lose it? Yes. Good job, bro. Yeah. Don't worry. Mm. Come on, you mother. Yes. Score. Get I swear his ar his hands here, are leaving this. Here. Come on. Didn't he say it was made of plastic? Can't you just cut through, like, you have a file. You could break the anchor on the on the pipe, but you couldn't, like, file through the pla plastic? What's the angle you can get? Uh, okay, I don't know what's, what's, what's gonna happen here. We need to cut this off, fast. How about these? Dude, you're Brock. Did that asshole... So now they don't exist, it's just, it's just the easiest, laziest dynamic to writing a racist. They can be so much more insidious and wrong, i.e. message boards and things. 
message boards and things. Disco Elysium's racist are obviously racist, but well written. Hmm. I think kind of racism do exist, but the dialogue writing itself is what makes it seem forced. The guy act and talk like a stereotype and basically explain the way he thinks for no re reason. People who act like that don't talk like that. Again, I don't have much experience with them. I could see someone being that bad, being deranged, and actually voicing themselves like that, actually. For you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. Wait. What, what happened? Yeah, what just happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. I didn't even see him go out of the room. Alright, let's grab some food while we're here. Steal camping gear? Absolutely steal some camping gear. Absolutely, yep. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to chill for the rest of your life. The hell with you. Kick him. Kick him. Yep. I told you to leave us alone. Sean, Take what are you Take some food, too. Daniel, come on. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Wait! You took some food too, right? Shit! Maybe the camping Where here includes going? a second bag or no? They took a they took a, they took a camping out. set just now. Okay. But we didn't see anything before Let's that. Go. I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. oh, it's this guy. You guys okay? That asshole at the gas station. We're fucking crazy. He tied me up in his back office. I swear. Dude, no more. I believe you. Okay. Just crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us. Yeah, something happens. It got a little more interesting there for a bit, but I don't know. Damn, that is crazy. And I thought I was having a shitty day. And I thought my jokes I knew were bad. That guy was sketchy. Why you freak out on us? Total fucking dickhead. Did he mess with you? Why you freak out on us? Why did he freak out on us? Good question, my friend. There are a lot of messed up people out there. And you've thrown a little racism. Yeah. I don't think he was down with our last name. Welcome to Redneck Land. I ain't Seattle no more. More Bigfoots than Mexicans. Only lived in one place. More Bigfoots. Yeah. My dad said there are more Bigfoots out here than Mexicans. No doubt. People out here are more scared of you and your little brother. This is nuts. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? You stole the dog? Come on, I'm not stupid. How did you manage to carry that dog all the way through. Daniel. What? You <laughs> saved her. We're heroes. 
Yeah. Yeah. Guess we are. So, what should her name be? Hey, your dog, Lila. Your choice. Oh, cool. Your dog, Let's your see. rules. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Pretty cool. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> is that a doge yeah. on the dashboard? Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. This guy is way too... Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> I'm suspicious. What's Brody's endgame? On the road for a long time? What do you do exactly on the road for a long time? Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money. But, no soul. I took off after school, and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. <sighs> oh, fuck. Alright, ignoring that, surely he's seen the news, right? He must know who we are. Oh my god. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Yep. Even brushing your teeth. The moon is political. How do you make money? Are you famous? Ever get lonely? How do you make money? Are you famous? Are you like famous or something? <laughs> More like oars. So everything is political is another phrase that I think people should stop saying. Because I think it hurts your cause more than it is. I mean, this is going to be like the, just the worst street for our reputation. I think a better phrase would would be to say everything can be interpreted politically. It's got the same point, and it doesn't set off some people's kind of like, wait, what? That doesn't make any sense to me. You're saying X is political. Well, if you interpret it politically in this lens, blah blah blah, then yeah, I absolutely can't be political. Okay, well that's a different statement. If you say everything is political. You're just you're just begging someone to be like fuck. No, I don't think so. What about this? What about that? And then and then eventually, you know, maybe even within two seconds, you get to well, no, everything can be interpreted politically. But it doesn't sound as snappy, right? I really don't like that phrase for that reason. <sighs> Something. But setting people off is funny. Yeah, but when you're talking about serious topics, is it? really worth the fun that you're having for the harm that you might also be causing at the same time? Uh, People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Okay. Well, that's enough for me. <laughs> yes? Okay. Awesome. Well, at least you know. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise... I'd be like my family. Nosebleed time. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? You just don't understand the politics of past the water. You're right. I don't. Wait, is that a term I don't know, or do you literally mean past the water? Yeah. He doesn't know about past the happens. water. Lameo. Thank you. Laugh at the streamer. Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. The Is Robocar police political? What do you think the police stands for? Of course. It's, it's my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. It's my thing. 
Alright. Uh oh. No music. Oh. Meal is singing instead. Is The Witcher 3 video political? I think parts of it uh, kind of get into a political um, place, yeah. North Oregon coast, three hours later. I guess we're not going to that, uh, that rock, Tacoma Rock. Stream mode cuts the music instead of replacing it. Yep, isn't it amazing? Man, can't wait to tell my friends how I helped these two kids. Man, look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Have a good political stream over there. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Oh, he does know. Okay, yeah. All right. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I yeah. don't even know what happened. We should trust them. It was so fast. My fucking fault. It was the police. I mean... Is it his fault? I don't think it's really his fault. I think the guy deserved a punch for what he said. He was the one that escalated, though. Like, more objectively, it is kind of his fault. But it was more the police's fault for, like, like what the fuck was that guy's problem? Let's go with the police. It was the police. It's their fault. Daniel just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops in, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> Fucking cops. Stupid gun. That was a bunch of bad lines all in a row there. Holy shit. Like part of that didn't even feel feel like it was recorded at the same time. Holy fuck. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? No. How? How? My life feels like... Like that town down there. Wiped out, destroyed, empty, like I have nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but 
What you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean. Who is this guy? At some point. You're gonna have to tell him. Wait, is this Arcadia Bay? Are we really? I know, I can't. I know. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I don't know, where are you going? I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. Should I go back? Should we keep going? <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but... Should we just keep going? Till we get to Mexico? Was oh, that where the lighthouse was the right in the back? To... Really? This was Arcadia Bay? Do. Yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No. No way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Shit. I okay. said that earlier. So you've still got a long ways to go. Long We've shot the shit long go. enough. Time to hit the road. Also was lost in the Arcadia Bay storm October 11, 2013. Time won't forget about you. Damn, it was it. Okay. I'll drop you by. Yeah, when I when I started the game, it asked me what to do, and I thought that the uh, uh, I just went with Arcadia Bay was was destroyed, and then when we loaded up again today, I thought that would be the more interesting one to go with to see what would happen, and apparently that's what happened. All right. So if it hadn't been destroyed, we would be just looking over Arcadia Bay right now, and it'd be there, and be like, hey, hi Arcadia Bay. Tell in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. That's fun. Legendary Max Cameo Miss. Oh, is she there if uh, if uh, Arcadia Bay wasn't sacrificed? Damn. Like in the background, tiny, like she's one pixel. Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. Mushroom, uh, mushroom. No. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> now it's a full moon. Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Too bad sandcastles never last. Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Pup wouldn't play fetch. Pup Let would me just do a look test at the stick. first. Cool. Well, okay, but I'm next. Pup okay, would be like, okay, what do you want me to do with this? Go wide. Come on, mushroom. Get it. Go, mushroom. All right. Did you play Returnal? If so, did you like it? I have not played it, no. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. <laughs> you go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. 
I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Come on, mushroom. Nice Get hoodie jacket. Stick. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. Today, me, floor. tomorrow, you. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay? But you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Chloe, to... you're not leaving, are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean... Ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. And money never came up again. Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Snatch. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. Oh, man. It's... Brody's gonna die now. now. Infinite barks. <gasps> okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Does the hotel allow dogs? Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. <laughs> Wish you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, Elf. Probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. So maybe they balance the extreme outlier asshole encounter with an extreme outlier nice person encounter. I don't know. Let's keep going. Brr, brr. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. How do we get the money back? Did he did he give us money? Feel guilty I took this, but that asshole had it coming, and Daniel needs to stay warm. I don't remember taking a raccoon sweater. Was that a part of the the tent thing? Even though I had to steal it. That that's definitely Brody's. He must have forgotten it when he passed the backpack on to me. Aw, oh, AFK. Brody has a letter in the backpack. He sounds really worried for us. Sean, I'm a better writer than I'm a speaker. That's why I'm writing this letter while you and Daniel are asleep in the car. While I'm driving. I'm sorry that I can't take you further, but there's a good reason to it. As dysfunctional as it can be, family is family. When we met, I was on my way to Utah, where my mom is currently losing her battle against cancer, and I have to be there. You'll find a few dollars in the backpack. That's all the cash I have left, but you need it more than me. Your goal is good. 
and you need to follow your instinct, but please be careful and protect your brother no matter what. You'll see when you tell him the truth about Seattle that sharing the same pain will make you stronger together eventually. When you get to Mexico, keep a low profile until you meet people you can truly rely on. In any case, I think you'll be safer there than you are here. A dead cop in the current state of things cannot be a good way to start negotiations. I wish I could have met you two under better circumstances, but I'm glad I could help you the best way I could. Take care, Brody. P.S. Hit me up when you're safe. A tribe called West. I'm always online when not driving. Sometimes even when I am driving. Been a while since I've used the pen. Hope you decipher. Can't look at this right now. It's just no way. Uh-oh. Miss you, Dad. No, we gotta keep moving. Nosy bitch. She was pretty nosy. Holy shit. Crazy racist played sheriff and trapped me in this shithole. Daniel saved my ass. Kid is brave AF. What happened after? Earthquake? Bumped into weirdo. Yeah, he definitely doesn't know. Bumped into weirdo while running away. He saved us. He's awesome. <laughs> Feeling safe for first time since Seattle, thanks to Brody. He's such a bro. Also, we picked up uh, an odd mushroom on our way out. Probably a bad idea, but whatever makes Daniel smile again. I still have to tell him. At least now I know where we're off to. Okay, good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Heavy Rain Hotel? Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If we're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. Okay, we're on the second floor for sure, right? Is there like a number on the key? Uh, there is no key. All right, or at least I don't see it. Time to check all the doors. Nope. Nope, he said room 10. Well, I don't remember that, so I can't use that information. Sorry, streamer's code, streamer's honor. Oh no. Nope. Nope. Maybe there's some uh, secret money somewhere. Asleep. Yeah, so keep it down. Shh. What's this one? Ten. You know, I remember him saying that. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV too. Cave and boy. there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice and warm. Oh, this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad, but too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Want to play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw. Oh, no. Shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Yeah, two out of three. Sure. Sure, I mean, you're going to lose again, but suit yourself. Not this time. Good old rock. Oh, Ty. Ah, come on. Good old rock. I won. Oh no. <laughs> the bed is mine. 
I knew I'd beat you. See? And I knew you'd brag about it. Don't be salty. It's a fair win. Yeah, it is. I surrender. All right. I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pigpen. I wouldn't be so sure, Cave Boy. Oh, it's the hot dog. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be oh, right Kate here. was successful then. Of course you will. Or was that not oh, an original cool. character? Hot dog man is on. Oh Ooh, God, there's so much shit to look at. I remember this episode. Weird, it's on so late. Sit and draw. Flyers. Brody gave us some cash so we can take one of these tomorrow. They're headed south. For for thirty dollars? Yeah, let's go hike tomorrow. Just for fun. <sighs> yeah. Fuck Halloween. Whoa. Wish we could go there and pretend nothing happened. Max and Chloe grew up watching Hot Dog Man. Oh, okay, it wasn't an original character. Excuse me. Oh, new tornado. Rest. It's nice out here. Wish I cared. Also, Kate Marsh is dead in this timeline. Killed by the star. No, 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 not everyone died in 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 that. I have it on good authority that at some point Principal Wells is gonna walk out of a bush and be like, "Hello, fellow kids." And it's just never going to be explained or commented on after that. Puerto Lobos, Mexico. Can I get us this far? And safe? How can we get there without money? And Daniel still doesn't know what really happened. How the fuck am I going to tell him? I tried to iron my shirts once. Burned it was a hole terrible. Them. A cheap souvenir for a cheap trip. Oh, Makes sorry. sense. Three three seals, two whales. <laughs> yeah, like I'm gonna sweep the carpet. Yeah, it's kind of weird that's there. <laughs> I can see why they left that tie. Whoa, it's a free tie. Take it. Also, free towels. Beware yeah. the wrath of power bear. We'll be coming back this way. Oh, free ice. That's water. Put it in your bottle. It's cool we got him something. What's that? Uh, it was in Brody's car. He gave it to you. Uh, well, uh, yeah. You stole it from him? I don't know. It looked cool, and you stole before, so I thought... Stealing is bad. No, man. Stealing is bad. We only do it if we really need it. Okay? Plus... Brody was super nice with us. If it's bad, then why did you do it? Hey, we had to. It, it was different. I don't want you stealing around, understand? Yeah. Wow, okay. she just, you just stole it from him. Daniel will be warm in this. That's a good thing. What's that? What Pyro is Pyro was wearing when they had to like hide her boobs in that one scene. I wasn't planning on getting rid of his bag, but some things do not change. Did this come out out after Xenoblade Chronicles 2? Damn, 
I could paint this shit. Nah. Are real bad. <laughs> Can't believe I'm that happy to stay at a motel. Are real bad. <laughs> Can't believe I'm that happy to stay at a motel. Thanks for everything, Brody. I'll be extra careful. Oh, it's the same note in case we didn't see it. Alright, new backpack. Man. Wish we still had Brody around. Oh man. I miss Brody. Brody, I miss you. Oh shit, that was wild. But we have a tent now. Okay, we can't use the phone while it's charging? Okay, when is it gonna cut to a news or whatever? Ask to lower volume. Hey, can you turn that down, please? Aww. Okay, okay. So, what's Joe, up? Joe, how's it going so far? The Pretty dull. To catch hot dog man and turn him in the sauce. Where does the something I miss you meme come from? Metal Gear Solid 2. Oh yeah. The giant meatball attacks in the next episode, right? Yes. And they get to meet the city mayo. Truck X <laughs> shows up. It's been ages. Why don't you watch Hot Dog Man with me anymore? I'm too old, dude. And I've seen it so many times. <laughs> okay, Grandpa Sean. Feels so good to sit down and watch TV. <laughs> True. Okay, just gonna end with him finding out his dad's dead. He just explodes the whole hotel. The whole hotel. Episode over. Tune in next time for another episode of Life is Strange too. Okay. Right, done. Okay. I'm done here. You're missing the best part. I know. Will the dog survive? The bath. Don't forget you're up soon. I know. The light on the outside. Oh, you don't want that. I kind of like you hotel rooms in a shitty way. If that makes sense. I miss GPS already. Yeah. But at least we're progressing south. Time to be a kid again. They're liminal, so true, chatter, so true. My hair feels like it's coated in dirt. A shower after Daniel will be bliss. Fill her up. Ugh, yuck, Sean. It's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey, don't touch that. Daniel will love this. No, he won't. Bubbles, what do you think I am? Eight? I'm nine now. I don't like bubbles in my bath. I like bubbles in my bath, though. Although I, I haven't had a bath in, like, 15 years. But I would still rock bubbles in my bath. One bubble bath coming up. Brother of the month. Yeah, right. You ready? Aw, the episode's almost finished. Nice try. The water's hot. Come on. Yeah, okay, I'm going. I have a bath tonight. Treat yourself for enjoying the straw. I can't. Our, our, our oh bath my tub is kind of fucked up. Whoa, so many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking the bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't 
fucked up how the bathtub i don't know who if they messed up the installation or whatever or if it never worked or if it's just because it, the the house was empty for too long before we, we moved into it but the bath has like water jets in the bottom um it's not that nice of a bath either, so I don't know why it has water jets in the bottom. And like, you hit a button, and it like like it'll just like like blast shit out. And it's just like it, it went on for too long that it's just completely like rusted and shitty water in it or whatever. I don't fucking know. So like, it's just the thought of laying in that when there's like little little holes in the bottom that like go into wherever the fuck is down there. Just like like no thank you. So uh, you know, just showers for me in uh in that tub. Where are you? I really thought. Phone away while Dana was washing. I really thought the TV would, uh, freak would change. Saw me. All right. We probably could clean it, but you know, that's a project. Actually, Time could to you? say goodbye to modern life. Without taking it apart, there, there's got to be a way. Too good for rusted sewer baths, yeah. Unfortunately. How upper class of me. Lily's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble too. Sean? Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. <gasps> with Daniel. Oh my god. Shit. Everyone's looking for you here. Are you okay? How about you? Are you okay? No. Playing it cool. How's Jen? Everything's fucked up. I'm so worried about you. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. I wish I could. Hell no. Hell no. <laughs> the cops will throw my ass into jail. Then what happens to Daniel? Stop it. Why Anything would they throw happen? your ass in jail? We can start a GoFundMe. Get you a lawyer. You know it's not that easy. There's nothing we can do. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. That's how it is. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. There won't be any dirty Mexican and Asian chick gathering. For a while. Just going away for now. Okay, I'm feeling more confident in my takes earlier. However, I do want to like maybe take a baby step back from them and say that there is definitely a way they could have had a character like that and an interaction like that and it worked, right? I think that's a good place to settle on. But I think that was just the nail in the coffin right now. What the fuck? Alright, cool. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. <sighs> I have to ask if jail is a threat. Why is it a threat? What crime has, has Sean committed here? Someone in chat said he assaulted the guy, but there's no way he's going to prison for that when it was just like, it's just two teenagers having like a brawl in the front yard after that happened. I think that the only thing that can make Sean's reaction here uh, palatable is that he doesn't know how the cop car got overturned and all this other shit. So like, they're not going to accept anything supernatural and Sean doesn't even know anything that supernatural is going on anyway, right? So like, I I'm guessing that like, they could just pin shit on him because they don't really know what happened. <sighs> I don't know.
Okay. Wait. Okay, okay. And action. Daniel, get your butt in here right now. What? What did I do? The cop died. Yeah, but he didn't kill a cop. And there's no, like... There's no evidence of an explosion that overturned a cop car or anything like that, right? I mean, like, the, the, the scene of whatever the fuck happened, like, anyone that shows up there is going to be like, wait, what? What the fuck happened here? You know what I mean? Like, the, this doesn't make any sense whatsoever. But that could still mean that, they, like, you know, he could be a scapegoat for that. So I guess it's all right. I don't know. I feel like he should be voicing this a little bit more, though. The cops, I think the cops would care, actually. If the scene doesn't make any sense, I think they would be looking at this and going, like, okay, what the fuck happened here? What went down here? If anything, just to be like, okay, is it going to happen again? I, I think... I think they would care, yeah. Underwear? That's it? Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? That's what Joe Sean is going back here. Joe, uh, no, I'm not saying he should go back. I disagree with his decision to run. But n now that he has run, I don't think he can go back. I don't think he should. I go when I was a kid. <laughs> Hot funny. <laughs> He's a scared teenager. Scared teenagers make dumb decisions. Yeah, and I would just like to hear why he's making these decisions more. Okay. Don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Maybe that's how episode two is going to start. Go take a shower first, though. You stink. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Come on, dance! Talk directly. Join. Uh, no, nah, we should be direct about this. Man, I, I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel, uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a How old is he, by the way? 17? Didn't they say, like, he only had one year left of math? So he... I guess, I guess he, depending on how you view that line, he could be 16, 17, or 18, right? He, he could be one of those three. Because it could be one year left means I, it, I'm i in my last year. One year left could be I have one year left after this. And in that case, he could be 16, very close to 17. So he's, he's in that area. A coat or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Seriously. This is a very Dad, difficult thing for what's the a 16 year old to do. Uh oh. Yep, this is talking directly. Two dollars? What? Back in my day, it was a dollar. Uh-oh. Should've had a shower. Daniel. Boom. Oh, oh it's the tornado. God. He's the tornado. Oh my God. Daniel, what's happening? Daniel, calm down. Shepard? It was an accident. I can't I can't remember. It was an accident. I'm Why? Why did you lie to me? I was scared. I was scared, Daniel. I didn't know what to say. You should have told me. I couldn't believe it either. I was about to, and then you asked for soda. I didn't mean to. I hate you! 
no, the tie. Don't say that. Chill out. Chill out. Daniel, chill out, okay? Get away from me! Shh. I hate you. Shh. Don't touch me. Oh my god, is this supposed to be a surprise? Are we like are we supposed to be like holy shit the kid has power is, is <laughs> Sorry just it, it just dawned on me Are we supposed to be shocked like he is right now? <laughs> Daniel, please oh. It's okay. We're not getting our security deposit back. I want that. <sighs> Me too. <laughs> you told me we were gonna see Dad. I'm sorry. I just... Don't lie to me ever again. Okay, I won't. He ever. lied. I promise. I'll try. I promise. I promise. I will always I tell the truth from now on. Again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. Danny? What are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Dun dun. Please be done. Please be done. Please be done. We're done, right? Don't be driving or something on a bus Sean. or going to a different line. Ah, oh, God. Am I a monster? Yes. Nothing is wrong with you. He lied. You're... different. Okay. How is a soda two dollars, but with 28 bucks they had a... Did, did Brody buy the bus tickets? Didn't he specifically say with the money Brody left we can get it... <sighs> what are we gonna do now? You put your bag on a seat? Bag isn't a person, bro. Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. He used to tell me bedtime stories too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers. One was named Chris Redfield. Died? Hunters took their dad away. Oh no! Forever. Wait, that's what's happening with us. So now the brothers were alone. And they had to find a new home. They started a journey to the great big
dialogue at DMC8. Miss Wilson's stream house, she hate this yet? I don't think I hate it, I'm just kind of indifferent to it. It's just mostly boring. Better than be before the storm, yes? Honestly, honest to God, at this point, it could go either way. And I am stunned that I can say that. It could go either way right now. We're on a knife's edge of whether this goes. This was pretty bad. Like, but, like, I didn't hate the first episode of Before the Storm either. I was pretty bored, but I didn't hate it. Be continued. Will it though? Episode one roads. Episode two, more roads. All right. You gave the Choco Crisp to Esteban. You gave it to yourself. Whoa. You told the truth to Esteban. You hugged Esteban. You didn't take money from the jar. You questioned Daniel. You decided to steal in the parking lot. What? What did we steal in the parking lot? I didn't steal anything in the parking lot. That's right. Oh, I did steal something in the parking lot. I thought it was the gas station parking lot. I'm sorry, I did, yeah. You didn't beg for food. You didn't steal anything in the gas station. You hit Hank and stole the camping gear. You called Lila back. You promised Daniel you won't lie to him again. 91%. Damn. That's going to come back to bite us all in the ass. Daniel learned about trailblazing. Daniel didn't fall in the woods. Because <laughs> we, just, we just left him and he teleported over it. Daniel fetched wood for the fire. Daniel won the wood race. Daniel learned how to skip stones. Daniel didn't get mad. Oh, I didn't know he could get mad. Daniel was afraid of your stories and had nightmares. Oh, whoops. Daniel didn't have to beg. Daniel didn't distract Doris. For stealing, I guess. Daniel didn't eat enough. Oh. Well, that, we were interrupted. Who knows? Just eat more bread. Daniel got a power bear toy. 19% nice Daniel stole something from Brody Daniel didn't steal anything okay friend stats okay only one person on my friends list has played this game <laughs> There's one friend. <laughs> oh, man. Trailer? All right. Come on, man. Focus. Oh, it's winter. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. Skip the stone. That's Fimble Winner for you. Play episode. Rules, Wastelands, Faith, Wolves. Oh no. All right, so that's uh, that's Life is Strange too. Aren't you excited for tomorrow's? Aren't you excited for tomorrow's stream? I gotta be honest, man. I gotta be honest. If tomorrow is just as boring as today, I don't know if I'm gonna finish. <laughs> I gotta be honest, I don't know if I can do five of these. <laughs> this was pretty dull. 
Again, can't even riff that wall off of it either. And any discussion we have is gonna be kinda, kinda yikes. <laughs> Very yikes. Let me go on Twitter and type out a tweet. Life is Strange 2 made me realize that gaming needs better racists, racists in its stories. Let me hit, let me send that out. There we go. Boom. This is gonna go fine. Nothing, nothing bad's gonna happen here. Here we go. Like, fucking hell. Can you play Yeek tomorrow instead, please? No! Yeek's gonna be even worse! Will you play True Colors? If we, we bow out on Life is Strange 2, then we will jump to True Colors and give that the same kind of test the waters treatment, okay? Because maybe True Colors is better, I don't know. I don't know. It's probably not. But usually when, once we start, we get to the end. And it's like, it's four more episodes and they're not that long, but it is four streams. Maybe if it's really bad, I'm just gonna stop talking to people and just, just blaze through it to see the main stuff. Joe, I just read a spoiler in spoiler chat. I need you to finish the game. Why? What? Is it gonna be worth it? For one epic May May moment that I assume that you've read? Like, I need to fucking get through the whole thing? It'll make you mad. I'm already mad! Oh, look at the trail. Hide venue. Oh, nice. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. Can we have it back? What a screensaver. Do, 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 do. Genuinely, I think you should play the four episodes and not touch the last one. T trust me. What? I'm pretty sure in the last episode, Max is gonna show up and say, no, I don't like how this went. Jump into a photograph, make it so that the beginning didn't happen, and once again, literally nothing happened in the whole entire story. First and last, please. Just just go to the last one. <laughs> uh, give it the ZDT treatment, make fun of it until it becomes fun. But it's 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 trying to tackle seriously serious subject matter. Like Z ZTD was bullshit anime. This is all about racial tensions in America. I can't riff off that. your re rewind powers to give me my day back. Aw, now I feel sad. Hey, you you consented to this waste of time. I can't guarantee you a good time all the time, all right? Am 
My disappointment is immeasurable. <laughs> and my day is ruined. All right, all right. I'm, I'm like so tired all of a sudden. Anyway, catch you all tomorrow for the, for this epic continuation of Life is Strange Two. Oh god, I'm doing that like cringy Michael Scott face where he's like, oh, like just. Like, this isn't going well. I thought it would be way better than this. Maybe we've run out of good games. <laughs> like, good stream games. <laughs> what if they're all bad from now on? There's gotta be something good on this list, right? 13 Sentinels isn't gonna be boring, right? There's no way. Deadly Premonition, that's gonna be fun, right? Right? Alciminium Files, there we go, we have at least one batshit weeb game left to play. Alciminium Files. Maybe we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to skip to something, like, really good after this. Did you guys pinned Truck X in the chat? I don't believe it. Fucking robo robo carpoli. Oh. All right. See you tomorrow, everybody. I started 13 Sentinels yesterday, and for the first thing I saw, I was like, oh, I can hear Joe sip this. He's going to sip it real hard. Oh, that's hot. Oh, man. That's hot. Anyway, see you later.